one. Oh, I hope it's this one. Oh. Hey, welcome to the Super Big Boy Show. <laughs> it's like, I felt like it was like literally the best name for it, Ryan. The Super Big Boy Show seems like exactly what we should call it. Welcome down to the yeah. Super Big Boy Show. What, what are you going to do? What you are you going to do? Ah, oh, come on, you fucking heap of shit. Yo, Drew it up, baby! Alright, let's say this exactly how we said it. Oi, oi, como va? Dude, the good old SBBS. Is that a sex term? It sounds like something that I would, uh... No, it's obviously the abbreviation for Super Big Boy Show. How the fuck do you not know your own show yet? Because it's only day one, and I'm autistic. I was just never tested. I can blame my parents rapidly for that. Or as they say in Mexico, rapido. I don't think they do say that. Oh, are you from Spain or Mexico? I don't know, man. I'm lost on my own bullshit now. I don't um, know, but I have been to Mexico a few times. Let's try and run some retro wave so quiet in the background. It's adorably small. Oh, hang on. I got some... Uh... Let me send you a, an EP of royalty-free, like, jazz hop. I'm Mexican vanilla. <laughs> Alright, so that's like crazy low, but it's probably still gonna get picked up. So this might be the first episode might be completely muted. Stick. Um <laughs> off to a great He knows start, these then. things. Oh dude, these great things. I'm gonna be eating this live. Cause I'm fucking gross, so everybody can hear me eat. Oh god, that crunch is making me so hungry. Right. Get some food! The Lazarus, what's up, baby? Welcome, everybody, to the Super Big Boy Show, otherwise known as SBBS, right next to BBC uh, uh, in uh, Pornhub Googles. Going to bed, love you, nerds. Love you too, man. Crunch, crunch. Thank you, everybody, coming from Mount Drew's stream. Wait, uh, hold on, what? I heard Pornhub? Pod don't worry about it, it's all good. Um, so, basically, the podcast isn't going to be anything like truly special, I suppose, because everybody's done everything already. Uh, but it's just uh, three nerds talking shit, or four nerds, I don't know, just a bunch of nerds, uh, just talking a bunch of shit about games and whatnot. And uh, you guys early brought up E3. Do we really need E3 anymore? I thought E3 was like, to show off to like, well, no. it, developers it, and, and like, it, investors. It Do we need that now? Hey, look, E3 just happens to be the point where everyone verges for their big reveals that's yeah, but, about it that's, yeah, but do we need it though things. do we need it no, we don't like no. it doesn't have it, a place it's, it's not something that we need i would say per se but you know eh, it is what it is uh, look especially with like most uh publishers and developers like doing their own shit fucking nintendo's got their direct sony had their other thing they've also got like it's not called sony con but i don't know what it's called because no one cares no so no sony, sony, yeah, sony con? does their own keynote yeah yeah at, at e3 though they, they, they don't they do, do what fucking, they, they did their they, presentation in two different rooms oh yeah. psx psx is their um oh yeah their convention yeah yeah um no but, okay. but i mean like you got the spurg lords no one's ego they're like <laughs> we're gonna go before everyone else so we're gonna host our own convention a day early it just happens to be at the same time but it's not coincidental at all <laughs> true go jerk Sorry. off and lazarus what's up at least you came here in time for the podcast <clears throat> yeah go e3 on. sucks because everyone does their own shit now yeah exactly and i have no water and i am a sad boy go get water I mean, it's, I think I think the reason I think I mean, E3 doesn't, no, would, doesn't need to no. be around anymore it's because devs can just put up betas and alphas and fucking cinematic trailers and gameplay and shit. Like, E3 kind of came down to the line of, like, doing a big presentation for investors but and, like, kind of potential buyers. But, I mean, realistically now, you kind of, like, go by track record of the company and then you also, like, kind of can already see the shit. Like... You could be like, oh, we're announcing a brand new Halo. And by like uh, two months after the announcement, I've seen like a cinematic trailer, some gameplay, and the beta will be out in two months. Like it just and kind of. Still, no one cares. Yeah, still nobody gives a shit because it's just, it's burnt out, man. It's burnt out as hell. Take that back. Oh, I'd gladly play the Halo when it comes to PC. Yeah. If it was on PC. Oh, look, I'll give it, it, it a It is. Halo Infinite is confirmed to come to PC. Oh, Big well. old dingus. 
Hey, I am a dingus, but it seems I was a bit behind on that information. I mean, oh, um, you know what? Now you're not, and boy, don't you look silly. Uh, I've looked silly my entire life. It's called having an afro, sir. And then when I shave it off, I look like a freedom fighter for a not-so-free Germany. Hi. Anyway, the point is, is that, I don't know, I don't think it really has a place. It seems like a lot of money put into, like, nothing. You and don't have a place. Most of the, dev, come, most of the devs that, rep, uh, like, like show their shit off there, you just kind of, like, roll your eyes out most of the time anyway. It's a bit cringy at this stage as well. I mean, I really only like the fact that, um... Oh, who yeah, but where else am I going to get to see Devolver fucking absolutely spurg out on stage? Dude, that's what oh, I was going to say. Fuck yeah. E3, don't even do an E3. Just give some money to Devolver to do like uh, like a, a, a like a full 30 minute spurg show like they did at the last two years. Because it's glorious. It's fucking great. Because they don't give a shit. They're like, we know we put out good content. Why the fuck would we spend all of our time and money putting together some sort of like autistic look at all the fancy shit we do when we could do like a gigantic meme and make fun of e3 while simultaneously like putting together like trailers i mean my friend pedro man i'm buying that day one i want to play it so oh, badly dude that looks so good wait yeah. sorry let me say it looks yeah. so fun mm, mm. i think that's uh the thing about devolver though they put out fun games not like good games if that makes sense they don't aim to get any awards. Yeah, they don't want to, like, win best graphics or immersion. They just want you to spend good money on a good game, and that's it. Uh, like... I don't think... I... Out of all the games I've purchased, Devolver's probably the only publisher I haven't been burned by in some way. Yeah. I never um, agree. They just... The hits fucking land every time. I mean... You kind of look at it like this, like you look at, and like Ryan and even T, you would know that like, I've been a gigantic, like fiend for uh, Bethesda for years. But even this year, I was yeah. like, oh my god! Like, I mean, even the like the last two years where they're just like re-releasing Skyrim one after the other, one after the other. I was kind of like, like you've just chipped away at my respect for your entire fucking company, and now they're like, blades, on your mobile. It's like, no, mm, you fucking... don't you fucking mobile me. Oh man, I hate mobile games though. Mobile games are trash. I mean, I know people like uh, my friend. What do you Blake. mean you don't want Diablo on mobile? Don't you have phones? Mo there's like, there's a place for mobile games. Yeah, don't you have a phone? Fucking trash. Don't you have a phone? We have Diablo on a phone. You all have phones. You should play it. Oh, like, wow. Like, truly in insulting your entire player base. You're all fucking the, idiots. Buy it. The the gaming scene for mobile games should be, and for the most part is, there's always a few exceptions, but it's just something you can sit down, play for 5 to 15 minutes, you know, just on the commute to and from work or, like, wherever you're going on the move. Yeah. Like, Hearthstone, it's fucking it's fine as a mobile game, you know? You just huh, sit down for yes. those 10, 20 minutes. Whatever. No, we need an entire competitive league, though. What? I mean, I, there is ranks. like professional yeah. Hearthstone. Like, I genuinely look at pre competitive Hearthstone, and I'm like just physically fucking lost as to what its appeal is. No, you know, you know what really is fucking. Oh, but um, all right. Uh, what is it? Yeah, there's mobile esports now. Yeah. Yeah, that's dumb. That's so fucking stupid. Yeah, like um, one of the Australian organisations for esports, uh, Avant Garde, I think it is. They picked up, uh, uh, what was it, Clash of, uh, Clash Royale, that's a bit. Some Clash game Royale. where the icon is some dude screaming. Yes. They're yes. all they picked icons up an eight-man team for that and added that to their roster. They're like, we're excited to expand into the, to the field of mobile, uh, esports. And it's like, you what? Also, you might want to check the stream. I don't know if it's my fucking end, but it's looking weird. Looking weird? What do you mean? Yeah, the train. I, uh, I think yeah, the transition, like a transition. work. So. Oh yeah, yeah. Work. I um, I changed transition because um, in the other, you guys don't have webcams or pictures, so in this mode it's me, but like you can see that who's talking uh, <laughs> the on the right hand okay. side. Uh, That's a better classic you. super big boy show. Just 
tech supporting while doing shit. Because it's not really tech support. It's just like anyway. The point support is me. the okay. The big question. Yeah. <clears throat> what pizza should I get? Oh, wait, that's a Yo, fucking good question. Hold on. Wait, What's you're changed? ordering from dog. Uh, just a local place, Pizza Boys. Do they're so fucking good. Oh, look, do they? Have they have they got like a speciality pizza, like like, like you know, a house special. Mm. Oh, okay. So I'm getting um a triple deal. So it gives me some. I'm getting three pizzas. Um, All I'm right, already getting the special. <laughs> they, oh, look, this is not just for me. This is also for the housemates when they come home tonight, and also mm. leftovers for tomorrow. So I, I don't have to go say, to the shop. How, how many slices are you giving them? Uh, T, you don't have to defend yourself to me, Chief. I know the value of buying pizza in bulk and then storing it for days afterwards. Chief. Plus, it's like 30 bucks for three pizzas, garlic bread, and a drink delivered. <clears throat> Look, yeah, you don't have to defend it to me. I'm just a cunt. So, I mean, that's, I mean, full stop. <clears throat> yeah. uh, okay, right. okay. So, so, here you go. Check it out, right? So, like a barbecue chicken and bacon style one. Uh,. Mm -hmm. Get 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 a supreme without olives because of well okay you're wrong but olives are yes. delicious but olives olives are they're an acquired taste in terms of the most useless shit ever to go on a fucking pizza also up there with doogie wait oh wait wait the no, most no, useless well, you know shit no, no, no. I don't put Sorry, myself I, up to eat one of my I just so. I just realized I was defending uh, anchovies and that's fish and I just re literally just spoke down and just realized that. I, I was okay, well, you know, I'm, buddy, I'm really glad that you that, that, that you come to realize that, you know, anchovies are fish. Well I done, apologize buddy. profusely. Is it fish or is it just like condensed salt found in the water? Uh, actually a fish because I use anchovies to make this salad dressing. Fair enough. Anyway, I've got a house special and a chicken Hawaiian. Did you ever throw that what's on, what's on What's on the house special? What's on the house special so that we Fucking yeah. everything. Okay, good answer. Also, answer. Chicken Supreme, good choice. Um, you know what? Probably need to hit it with a third. Yep. Uh, I'm thinking something classic, something OG, like a deep dish fucking pepperoni. Okay, oh. I was tossing up between pepperoni or a margarita. Oh, dude, pepperoni every time. Fuck a margarita. I mean, you know, on occasion, margaritas are nice. Nice yeah. little. And on those occasions, you're wrong. Wow! Yeah, bit judgy, bit judgy, yeah, bit judgy. Just a little bit. Being a bit um, judgmental there, Duke. How about the man just orders the pizza he fucking wants to order, hey? How about how about you? Yeah, know? well, he he's he's already you know. Oh, Duke's in his in his right. I I put the question out for your opinion. Yeah, exactly. And I hit that boy back. Yeah. yeah. With a wrong opinion, so I'm ignoring it. Duke always hits well, back. Okay. I'm joking. But, I am know. getting a pepperoni, by the way. Nice. Good. Big pep. Get a big pep. Mm. God damn, I'm so glad I got this Japanese curry. It was between this and a burger. I made the right choice. Mm. Burgers real yeah. hit and miss with delivery. Mm. Whereas, that's, the, that's the problem there. Actually, the Maccas around the corner from me has been surpri surprisingly consistent. Actually, you know what I got delivered the other day? I got, um... Uh, I got burrito bar. I got Ooh. nachos, but I got it with the, uh, the potato chip instead. Like, like, like the actual, you know, like the Mexican wines, those chips. No, they're like the it, corn chips, but they're like. No, 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 dude. You, you know when we used to go fuck up wings and we'd get like the the tray of fuck chips to go between all of us or whatever. It was those chips. But they used that as the basis for a fucking nachos. Ah. Uh, that, that shit was delicious. It was the yum yum. I put it in my tum tum. Truthfully. And then it came out my bum bum. Truthfully, they can go fuck themselves. I think they have such a poor business acumen now that they've decided to like basically shit up the quality and and or quality mostly qual maybe mostly quantity. Sorry. Oh god, yeah. Um, what's going on in here? Yo, Lexi, what up, girl? Nothing. We're doing the Super Big Boy pod. Uh, yeah, super nothing Big Boys. Here, bitch. Super the Super Big, Big Boy show. Because we're Super Big Boys. And uh, I'm going to upload it to YouTube after this. Because I was like, not? you know what? 
professionally recording, editing, cutting down, and uploading is difficult. So why not just live stream a shit show and then upload that? The logic's there. Ah, oh, shit. What's my PayPal password? I don't know. Say it openly out here with your username, uh, with your email. Right. Uh... I need something to overdraft. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> oh, fuck. The story of my goddamn life. <laughs> I know. I remember that time you jumped on. You're like, guys. Ah, uh, fuck. I bought a keyboard. What? I bought a keyboard, guys. I overdraft <laughs> my account by $150. I'm like, fucking Christ. You were so drunk you bought a keyboard. I was so drunk. <laughs> I still have my old keyboard as well. Still works fine. Yeah, you're like Nothing asking me if with I it. need a new one. I'm like, nah, man, I'm all good. <gasps> oh, fuck. That's so good, man. That is so... I feel like you took it so casually. I would have stressed the fuck out that I just spent that much money on well, a keyboard like I shit. don't need. It had already been, like, processed and sent off when i woke up and saw the fucking thing uh, speed delivery so it's, it's like what can i do you know god no damn point speedy stressing. delivery god damn efficiency is what fucked you up here it, yeah for the first time in ebay's fucking life the shit was delivered first thing the next morning yeah man i order stuff from like the same i'll be ordering stuff inside brisbane it's like it's uh, four days it's at the holding yard i'm like oh my god where's the holding yard i'll go get it fuck Holding yards at the fucking dog's dickhead. Ah, oh, well, now I know. <clears throat> I mean, I order most I think things from I'm China. Uh, Hank PayPal has that money rocked up yet? I bet yeah, it hasn't. PayPal. You're not wrong, even. Uh, you know, the fastest items to be delivered are things that you order when you're drunk. It's true. That is statistically uh, true. It's true. What the fuck is going on? This chat uh, uh, should be showing up. Me. Why Bank is the chat not showing up? Like, I'm clicking Ugh. on it. I see it at the bottom, but it's not showing up. Uh, Delivery arrives at 8.40. Huh? Bring to front. It's already at the tippy top. Well, it, it mustn't be. It is. I swear to God, I'll slap what, the dick what's... clean up your body. It's there. What's I don't know why it's not coming up. Whatever. Well, look, man. I'm just saying I'm watching the stream. Who and I'm just saying. Who oh, no, no, no. Lex is right. The chat is there. It's just so tiny. No one can fucking read it. Why are you so oh, tiny? Yeah, okay. Oh my god, yes. you are fucking miniature. But it's like not even at the bottom of the actual. I mean, you know, look, I need to bring up the fact that they kept saying that to me the last poor house I went to, but like, come on, buddy. <sighs> okay, wait. Okay, let's try that. It's a big boy. It's a big boy now. This is the best fucking podcast on YouTube and Twitch. Why the why fuck has it been such a bag of dicks for such a like? Why is meh? Yeah. <sighs> Rukan. All right, let's do that, and then I'm gonna go over here, and then I'm gonna click on that, and then I'm gonna do here, and then go there, and go here, and go there. <sighs> oh man, I've I'm actually nearly full. Like I must have lost weight because like I would usually be able to fuck this curry up and be like done with it, and right now I'm like struggling. Like and I'm then half an hour later, the curry would fuck you up. Oi, I get straight up banged deep within my hot young tool God party all the time. All right, so that should be a lot better. If you guys chat, it should work. See me, su see, suck me. I was right. I won't suck you. I won't do it. I appreciate the offer. I'm a man of uh, nobility, so I will say no on the internet to suck me's. Hey, guys. Yeah, that's readable. Thank Speaking God. of uh, uh, podcast shit that weren't dated at all, and if we uh, talk about current events, um, from ABC News a day ago, Toto's Africa set to play until the end of days thanks to an art installation in Namibia. What? Oh, hell yeah, I love my Namibias. What are we talking? I'm, this is gibberish to me. The fuck? Uh, I'm, someone's. Uh, that was just a headline, but. Do you have any other uh, information? Trek far enough into the sands of the Nabib desert, and you might just begin to hear the distant but unmistakable sounds of Toto's Africa. What the fuck? Um, it looks like... Um, someone just set up an MP3 player 
what? It's six speakers. The only song is Africa. It's on loop. And it runs on solar power. Why would anybody spend time to do such an artistic <laughs> thing? Because it's an art installation, Reese. Some government probably paid me half a fucking million dollars for them to go get a Bluetooth speaker, plug it into a fucking solar panel, and eat that cunt on top of a brick house or some shit. Boom. Oh no, done. they're not even Bluetooth. They're all hardwired. Oh, also, it's Jonas the Bangor, whatever so, it is. I mean, it's all gonna be stolen in two fucking weeks anyway. It's in the middle of the fucking desert. If anyone pinches them, good on them. They earned it. They earned <laughs> that, that fucking $20 MP3 player from Wish. Fuck you, I'm gonna rack it just out of premise now. Hey, don't shit on Wish. I've had quality items delivered so far. Uh, Where's congratulations, that... boys. I found dinner for tonight. Where's that damn GPU that I ordered? Fucking wish. I'm gonna build the fuck out of you for even saying that. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm joking. <laughs> Nobody who is listening to this ever buy a fucking GPU from Wish unless you want your entire computer to be face fucked. Exploded. Yeah. Why you would you don't. even. Because I think people, that's a good idea. Uh, look, no. Uh, multiple YouTubers, so Linus Tech Tips, uh, Hardware Unboxed, uh, Science Studio. I think Hardware Canucks did one as well. All these big tech YouTubers have all done that sort of video because it's such easy content for them. They just, you know, they throw a couple hundred bucks at like Wish, AliExpress, eBay, somewhere, get these yeah. these air quote cheap GPUs. I mean, it makes sense. And then sense they for plug them, them into it. a test bed and they see what they actually are. And sometimes you do actually get what you order on the box. It's just that you know. You get like a factory seconds, so one that's probably not going to run as good as, say, like, you know, the 1060, which it's meant to be. I mean, look, Sorry. if you can't afford a 1060, then you shouldn't be buying like a two. Like, why do you, why would somebody buy a $200 GPU off Wish? Is it just like, well, it's made, most, most pieces of equipment are made in China. So buying directly from a Chinese distributor from some no-name GPU must be just as good. I feel like that's the like the level of understanding that people just think that because things are made in the same place that you can get the same quality at a cheaper price because it comes off Wish. Um, people are dumb. What? People are real what dumb. Did I, I bought something off Wish. That wasn't disappointing. No, I haven't oh, been I bought a Taser. Oh, how did that go? Where, I mean, they're illegal, but only through Wish I, I, can you succeed and get these things. Well, look, my housemate also ordered a few. And Customs got some of them. <laughs> Ordered a few. <laughs> Ordered a few tasers. Hey guys, just got a few tasers in. Just got a couple. Nah, they're, they're not strong by any stretch of the magician's penis. Oh my god. But it's just a fun little thing to have around. I wish know? that would catch on for real, man. I really wish that would catch on for real. You hold the button, you jam it into someone, and it feels like you're getting stabbed with a bunch of pins. Oh. It, it's not pleasant. Does it work? It's... Do you think, did, would it incapacitate somebody? So say Maybe if you I hit him in like the head or the neck and be like, hey bro, I'ma stick my penis in you and don't want to. Oh uh, dude, it'd hundred percent work uh, if I jammed it into said penis. Um Okay. But say uh, okay, so but say into, we're into like, say, say the say, stomach. Say, we're no. a bar fight. say I'm coming at you with a bar knife. You reckon okay. that taser's gonna stop me? No, but if we're at a bar, I have a glass and or bottle. That's what a bar knife is. Uh, yeah, that's a bar well, knife. There you go. Bar knife is a broken bottle. I uh, I bought a 1050 because that's the only thing that would fit in my computer. That's pretty fair. That's pretty fair. I bought a 1060, and gonna be honest, I probably shouldn't have because it is real sketchy in inside my case. Uh, I mean, I want to get a 1070, but I mean, I pretty much come to the conclusion that a solid state drive and a and, a, and an Oculus is probably going to be more in my range. Autistic well, uh, VR gameplay is more probably my level on Twitch than anything else. Also, <laughs> what card do you have in there at the moment? Uh, a R9 380. Oh, okay. Yep. So, I mean, it's working. Since I put the capture card in there, everything's working hunky-dory, so I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty well, sure yeah, Taser would just card. make me laugh at this point. Hmm? Huh? Lexi's offering for you to Taser. Uh, well... I'll have to sort something out then. I'll have to hang out sometime and uh, tase around. You know what I'm saying? Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. If you know what I mean. Yeah, he's talking about. Zip, zap. <laughs> hey, girl. Let me put my electric 
fraud in you. Oh no. Oh, I don't like that. That wasn't good. Actually, nope. That wasn't good. Without, without going into too many details, I have seen a video of something similar to that happening. And this it was, podcast um, sponsored by ExtremeRestraints.com. Oh. <laughs> it was, that, um... Is that a BDSM place? It feels like a BDSM place. Uh, just, just a sex an, place it, in general. It was an experience, that's what it is. I mean, restraints made me think that it was a BDSM place. But yeah, sex place in a general sense. In general sense. Um, having enough electroshock therapy for it to be redundant at this point. That is such a deep fucking hole to go down that I am going to back right out of it. Right quick. Deep hole. <laughs> really? <laughs> Hashtag oh. content. Uh, I mean, what more you are expecting? I'm just, do, do you have anything to drink or are you just being yourself? <laughs> I'm just fucking being myself, too. I really wish I got some alcohol. <laughs> what a regretful... Oh, you didn't? Oh. I didn't, nah. I didn't have the, didn't have the car uh, for... Oh, fair yeah. enough. Yeah, so I ordered a little bit. Of, like, I was hoping that... I tried to see if Schnitz would sell me alcohol. Schnitz didn't sell me alcohol. The bunch of assholes. Don't you have, like... Thirsty camel up there? Uh, yeah, but I like the delivery is kind of like I think it's next day. It's not like current day. Yeah, oh. dude, shout out to Snitz though. Hey, Fucking... sh shout out to Snitz. Give give me a sponsorship. I want free Snitz. Give me a free Snitz. <laughs> hey, hey, right. Snitz. You are fucking awesome. Just give me give me some free chicken here here and there. You Throw know? an OMG my way once in a while. <clears throat> Cause that's a good fucking burger, man. Snitz is delicious. I feel like you know when Grilled came out, everybody's like, oh my god, Grilled's like the next hot thing. And then, um, and then that flip out. Like, last time I went to grill, I was like, man, I'm craving grilled. And I got there, and, like, the patty was smaller than the fucking bun. And the chips were, like, a half-filled cup. And, like, Actually, I walked over and I asked, I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, I'm like, what is this? I'm like, this is, like, I've got half-filled chips and, like, my burger is... I'm like, I get a bigger burger at, at McDonald's. And they're like, oh, sorry, that's our portions. It's like... What portions, motherfucker? This is a forty dollar meal. Hold on, Sounds like you have a shit Wait, grill. Yeah, here we go. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna send sense. it to you in your DMs so I don't dox you with people. Uh, send it to at... Bacon Bit Barry so I can check it on my phone. Um, because uh, I'm like uh, because I'm uh, display capturing the. Yeah, listener. there you go, Chief. Whoop, whoop. Uh, oh, this should be good. Yeah, yeah this, place, this, place, this place looks legit, man. I want to fucking go here. Thank God you didn't, uh, hit, didn't, uh, sorry. Thank fuck you didn't, um, dox me again. Oh, I've already been there. <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, a bunch of times. Uh, look, man, if we're talking about tasty shit, yeah, man, that's for sure. Actually, one thing yeah, we can talk about, but yeah, they're good. They're good. They're not amazing, but they're good. I'm here for the talk show as a special guest. I mean, Commissar, if you want to jump in on the action, you're more than welcome on Discord. I mean, look, dude, you, you can say they're not that great, but for, like, 15 bucks for, like, burger, fries, and rain. Yeah, well, I mean, what you can do is spend, uh... What you can do is spend, like, basically 10 bucks, get a burger, and then also grab some wings for four fifty, and you've got fourteen fifty with wings and a... And the wings mm. are good. The normal marinade on those wings will do the... F FAT COMMIES! Wait, in your uh, pants. Um, wait, 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 where's the wings from? That's so good. They do wings there. Oh, okay. But yeah, Comey, if you want to jump in, man, feel feel free. To, and the flip side, uh, enough of I guess, is the shock rod will be a giggle at. Ah, uh, it sounds like a sex thing. So yes, many oh, giggles. Shock <laughs> therapy. So Lex, when you say shock therapy, are you talking about that little box? I can't remember the name for it. Box but it box. comes with like four to six like pads that you just sort of strap to your body. What, to get abs? And then you... No, not to get abs, <laughs> just to like. I've seen that. Have a look at that one. A massage, I guess. I don't know. My dad had one, and I tried it once, and it's like, um, man. tens machine. Yeah, that's yeah. it. That's the one. Tens unit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's in drag me. Oh my no, god, no, no, no. I fucking have hate to, that I have to shit. add you to call, bro. I have to add you to a personal call. I figured it was good if anybody had a webcam, but these two autists don't have webcam. Well, I one of them webcam. does. But his I, camera I don't shy. have a webcam set yeah, up. I could set up a phone cam, but if, if I could be my bothered, bro, is an absolute shit show. If I get the chance, I'm not cleaning it if next week. Wish if, invites me to a dirt cheap 1080 air quotes webcam, I will buy it for you. <laughs> if it's like his five dollar 1080p, I'm gonna be like, yeah, okay. Ryan doesn't have one at all, so fucking, there's literally no loss here. <clears throat> I'll be happy birthday, Wish. 
how is just your happy birthday? You get it in two months because it's not on Express. That is because nothing fucking is disgusting, wish. bro. That is that one. That is a grotesque fucking oh, burger. Show bro. that again. Oh fuck, that looks good. No, it looks in like in the worst possible way. Like it looks like ten disgusting vaginas stacked on top of each other. Um, rip fucking right, Do you want me to drag? We, we, we can go experience some real burgers. Man. That's it, mate. That's it. Oh, speaking of coming. I'm going to um, invite I'm going to... Uh... You heard what I said. Oh. Uh, uh, Sai, you got any... Yeah, that transition Updates. is not great. No, it's not yeah, great. Any, because I have to... Because I have to terrible. take it down display so I don't get doxxed in my own Discord. Fair or enough. So I don't dox other people. Um, how do I invite? Did somebody else start... No, wait, there we go. Okay, cool. So, com... Is, uh, it's not popping up. I don't think I'm your friend. Uh... No, we're not friends. What kind of Tom fucking foolery is this? Uh, profile. Send friend request. Wait for friend request. Oh my god, how good was that general photo, photo like video though of like the the I love Aussie guy just because like the chick doing the flips. Uh -huh. He's like what? fucking flip, fucking flip, fucking splitty things, fucking flip. Uh, basically what? tense the muscles. Oh, it's in the general chat for the um. Uh, the gym? This isn't like Aussie guy yeah. reviews, is it? Yeah, it is. Nah, fuck that guy. I'm, I flat out refuse to give him any sort of view or fucking patronage whatsoever. He's a cunt. Whoa! No. Nope. Whoa. Okay. Nope. Okay. Okay. Nope. Fuck him. Um, I'm trying to remember who did a video on him. Um, Commissar. I think it was Lewis. Hey, Commissar, how about you just become my friend and you and yeah, it's because I, like I don't really see you on the server. Look, you know what? I have I have the worst Discord out of like almost every motherfucker I know. Can you just accept the friend request so I can invite you to the fucking call? You sexy bastard. Please just do it. Um, um you are my uh, friend, dude. It's not letting me add you though. There we go. That video. There we go. For some reason yeah. it wasn't coming up. There we go. Add to call. Full screen display i'll check it out later i have like oh, man, oh yeah dude i'm not saying watch it now but mm. like yeah from memory basically he it was just fucking rehashing like um alex williamson jokes and all this other shit and he fucking when he got called out on it he was basically telling everyone to go fuck themselves and they weren't fucking you know they didn't know what the fuck they were talking about and all this other shit i mean that yeah, doesn't no. blow me away though i mean like the whole joke stealing thing is pretty goddamn common these days yeah and also yeah just his content in general just fucking makes me think he should just take a jump off a bridge oh, he's a bit of a cum pirate i mean like honestly i've i mean content creators are like running out of ideas man so that's like oh yeah i understand stealing... that oh no 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 i'm not making excuses they're just stealing content from people that are still making original content just run out of ideas, you cunt. It's not like YouTube's <laughs> meant to be a viable career path for everyone. I mean, hey, it's supposed to be a viable career path for people who are going to put in the effort, or it's a viable career path because it's a stepping stone into something else, which is what a lot of great content creators have done. They've just, like, used it and picked up, like, a job in animation, uh, commentary, or, like, a... Oh, you know, fuck, that's what I was meant business. to do. Oh, well, that's uh, disappointing. Um, <clears throat> but, yeah, mm. so... That, I mean, that doesn't surprise me. Yo, Commissar, are you there? Yo, what's good, baby? I'm actually on Twitch to become an actor, so, uh... Oh, really? Oh, can't, shit. can't tell a serious or not. I have such bad news for you. Not bait, by the way. I, I don't believe you. You're... Yeah, I, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna just say that's big bait. Big fusion bait. It's okay, Commie. I believe in you. <laughs> oh, God. He actually doesn't believe in you. I'm sorry. He's lying yeah, to you. He <clears throat> just so you know uh, he lies a lot he does. Oh, yeah, the worst he part is. about this i, I come on here i start spilling my heart out to you guys and everyone shits all over me dog yeah. you know i mean but the good news is, is that you're actually into scatting so i mean it works out for you better than the song better than the song Fuck you, the song's an original banger. Oh my god. Oh, I, 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 I think. It actually is. Is a better banger. I mean, look, I'm not saying it's the best. I too enjoy Just banging saying. on desks. I uh, mean, oh, I, hope, I hope the dogs are terrified now. I hope they, I pro they probably are, man. Okay, I'm dripping for a bit. 
<laughs> dipping, oh, thank god. I was about to say, dripping is the most fucking disgusting thing anybody could say before leaving. <laughs> Oi, boys, just I'm just going to go drip for a bit. I would never say that to anybody, but oh, thank god. I mean, I'm maybe... Well, you don't like uh, drippy women? What's wrong with you? Look, hey. Later, Lex. <laughs> you don't... Yo, you don't like drippy women? <laughs> fucking gross. <laughs> Yo, you don't like a nice drippy woman? You don't like... What are you, gay? What, what are you, gay, man? Oi, oi, oi. Whoa, 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 whoa. 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 Whoa, whoa, Cicero, you go. No, I, no yeah. I was just talking about the original. As much as I love that guy, man, he's got a fucked up last name. <laughs> I know, it's like, why even try? Forever and ever, I'm going to say, Coach, I got a drip. I mean, you fucked it up. Coach, I got a drio. I mean, you could say that too. I would still be like, I got a. I gotta drip out, guys. I'll see you later. Oi, boys, just, uh, I gotta drip off. I gotta go quick, quickly go drip. I gotta drip. I got shit to do. Yo, so uh what's the uh what's the end game with this uh this here uh podcast episode uh, thing? End Wait, game. Produce it the in the most lazy fucking way possible and do it regularly. And the end game is put something on YouTube. That's pretty much it. Jesus. Yeah. Yep. Hi YouTube! Hi YouTube! I'm uploading again, though it is the autism of uh an extra two hours of in, that I had this week. Uh, Fuck yeah, I, I can send this to mum and be like, hey look mum, I'm famous, why don't you love me? I mean, you don't want to hear the answer for that. Be like, mom, listen, first of all, I'm I'm making making waves out here, I'm making moves in the right? industry, you know, I, I was I'm just recently- I'm shit up out here, mum. <laughs> mum, you don't even know, you can go and drip off. Hey, mum, go drip you yourself! Me. Fucking drip yourself, mum. This is why my parents don't love me, man. Sorry, honestly, I'm so this the reality is so real for me. What's up? The Halzos. Oh man, fuck the Halzos. That's shitty content. That's true. No, 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 no. I, as in, Haley and Jordan are out and getting dinner, and they're like, "Oh, hey, what do you want? Do you want?" Oh, are oh, they buying oh, or are oh, they just oh, getting it for you? Um, they're getting it for me. They are paying because I am one broke boy. Oh, so there you I go. Am back on Monday. Well, he's got that cash money job now, so he can buy you yeah, nice, exactly. pretty things like the yeah, fuck. Yeah, if that's the case, it. tell him to pick you up a steak from like TGI or something. Yeah, or fuck like no, go to the. Actually, I'm getting a uh, Ripper Mega Box combo. That's oh good shit! Fair enough. Good that's choice. just as expensive. I feel like yeah. this camera is showing like the most fucked up. Like you can see like all the acne scars all over my head. No, I'm that's just, not that yeah, bad. God's sake. Huh? Maybe hey, in Discord, hey, but on hey. the stream it's not bad. Oh, well, sweet. That's good. That's good shit. What kind of camera do you have? Uh, I have the most basic boy camera that everybody has. So the C920 is what you're C920. saying. C920! Gold standard of uh, online video feed entertainment. Online that video. That was the last thing I bought from Wish. It was my webcam. That was like two dollars. It looks like a big bag of cancer. Is what it it's looks like. It's not great. It's it's roughly two forty p. Sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. Oi, you can't have the best of the best all the time. Sometimes you just gotta just deal with having a shitty webcam. Some, sometimes you just gotta jizz deal. Hey guys, I bet he wishes he didn't buy it. Uh, 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 <laughs> hey. Uh, your guys like um fucking yeah in audio quality whoa your audio quality oh just took God. a dive hard what, there. what are you doing uh one i'm gonna go have a look at the driveway to see if my pizza's here oh, two whoa. okay pizza's gonna get some more drank oh my god that sounds good i wish i got some drank mm. fucked up dude i'm so glad i fucking discovered mercury oh you're drinking mercury now mercury what <laughs> Just Mercury. Mercury. Uh, oh, the, uh, I think it's Mercury Hard Cider. 6.9% ones. That sounds like a super feminine drink. Alright, yep. Slap me about. Uh, two standards per can. 
<laughs> Say what you want about it. I mean, look, I'd rather just have a 1.7 on that, uh, on that, okay, uh, so, one turkey. Okay, so, let's see, so, Kate's on that run about 53. Yep. Unless you go to, uh, to my bottle, though, it's 40 I bucks at the moment. I don't give a fuck about your fucking ball off the back of the truck and it's slightly out of date fucking bottle. That bottle is hey. <laughs> shit and I fucking hate you. I also bought a bucket of jelly shots for 10 bucks. Oh, you fucking <laughs> loser. <laughs> Can you get a good webcam? Because that's content right there. Hey, guys, I just, right. bought, <laughs> I just bought a bucket of jelly shots. <laughs> and I'm going to drink uh, all of them right now while playing four different card games. Oh, God, God is, don't say that. Uh, I'm missing drinks from one of those, uh, them there cans. Me hey, oh, Thomas, like, have you heard of this man's, like, meta? So... It, this man right here, he will. He yeah, at one point was. Drinks. He was at yeah, one point. Tino was at one point streaming himself playing four card games at the same time. I've done it a few times. Yeah. Now that's content. I mean, that's not that uncommon though. Oh my god. Isn't it? Because I've never seen anyone else do it. Good enough for you, Tommy. No, I mean, some people do it though. It's kind of a good meme, you know. It's a solid it's meme. It's a great meme. Except that's why I did it. You can't physically keep track of that many card games at the same time. No, 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 no viewer understands what's going on. They just know that like, they just look at one side of the screen and are like, oh yeah, this looks interesting. Yes, yeah, quaint, quaint. Yeah. Uh, yes, it's Gwent, is it not? Yes. Uh, use your yeah, card. That's, that's a bad pricing, Chief. That's a dollar and ten cents odd. Hopefully if you for, pick uh, up a uh, uh, blue eyes white dragon, the next oh, card for the on Gwent. Yeah, that's, that's yeah, even if even outside of my cheap off game? the back of the truck bottle, like, like at a BWS, it's like 25 bucks for a 10 pack. Oh man, I'm so thirsty for alcohol now. Fuck. Hey coach, did you do the uh, 2009 versus 2019? Oh, fuck you. Fuck you for even <laughs> asking me that. Right, I'd rather jump off a bridge. I'd rather honestly dunk my balls into my own mouth than fucking do that. Where's a picture of me in 2019? I showed my stream a handful of pictures. Sexual? I just want to see you do that because I reckon that would be very impressive. Hey, check yourself. Hey, God, no, I don't okay. want to be sad. You leave this I don't want to see how you're out. fucking done with that fucking dog. I was dog. back in the day. 2019. I mean, look, 10 years ago, uh, my, my 10 years ago, I posted this on Facebook. You know where it's like, hey, here's, here's your history. Here's and then you go through your history jealous. on Facebook. You're like, oh man, fucking 10 years ago I was an autistic boy. One sec, I gotta... What flavor yeah. should I ha hook into? We got purple, uh, grape, blueberry, cherry, apple, or lemon lime. You tell me. Wait, hold on. Run those by me again. Grape, blueberry, cherry, green apple, lime. Lime. Because I'll be honest, all the other ones sound like they're just going to be chemical flavored. Uh, Probably. I had, what did I have the other day? What did you have the other day, young squire? I, don't know. I had one of them and it was actually pretty good. Right. You know how there's there's like those shot buckets? No, I don't. Um, I don't know what a shot bucket it's like, is. It's a bucket of shots. Doesn't explain uh, what it is too well to me right now. It's a bunch of prepackaged shit, similar to like that, except it's like split in half, and there's two shit, or there's two things in there. Split me in half. The bloody lemon limes on the bottom. Oh, anyway, they're fucking garbage. They're so shit. Um, and they always make me sick. These ones are okay. This is like the lowest quality fucking stream ever right What now. do you expect from me? I'm not expecting anything from you, okay? And but yet I want... you're still disappointed. I've never disappointed you, baby. Ten years ago. Ten years ago, I said... <laughs> so you remember when your status went in front of your name? I said... Say what? My name is Hungry and woke up at 3.30pm today. You. Why would I post that? Why would you post that? Because that was 10 years ago, 2009. When, how old was I 10 years ago? I was 20... Oh, God. oh fuck, no, I was I 16. Like... Oh, yeah, fuck, I was my... 16 and that autistic? Dude, dude there's, my post on Kickback is 2011. Nah, man, 10 years ago for me. I was on that day one, um, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, apparently... Uh, where are we, fuck it. Fucking... <laughs> where, where were we? You, Fucking... Actually, dude, you remember, uh, moving? Use your uh, camera, Commissar. Don't be a dick. Uh, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. We're using cam? Yeah. Uh, yeah, dog. Yeah. I wasn't I mean, doing it because it. we didn't have any cams going. So I was just putting them on yeah, myself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But fucking, fucking moving from Xbox. Apparently, oh, look at that sexy said piece. About, where are we? <laughs> that moment when some fucker makes a joke about a grandmother and she's can't talk or do anything for half an hour because it's too much from laughing. I'm guessing I was drinking and said something. 
Probably. You probably talked absolute shit like you usually do. I mean, look. Let's be honest. <laughs> Mercury. Hard cider. Dude, it's Let's so be honest. There was so much good. drinking back then. Oh, man. I miss drinking. Yo, are we all getting turned? I uh, wish I had alcohol. Well, I mean, I am. One sec. I, I was told that everyone else would have alcohol. One and sec. By everyone, I might I mean have the alcohol. Coach. Oh, actually, where are we? Town. Mm hmm. Here you go. A bit of a throwback for you, mate. Back when me and my mate were drifting still views in Forza 3. Oh, man. I got excited and thought you were actually drifting Sylvia's. Oh, fuck that, man. I think I'm that skilled. Less. Oh, it's not that hard to drift. If I could do it in the Pulsar, surely you could do it in a better car. The implication is that I have a better car. Uh, sorry, that, that I have a car that I can drift in. Well, I never said it had to be yours. Oh, okay. Sorry, I'll just go out and boost someone's car. I did used to get my grandparents' Commodore sideways. Case in point. Yeah. And and, and then they and then I'd like get the car back and they'd be like, why is the car smell like burning? I'm like, oh, I don't fucking know, man. Victorian drivers are roundabouts, am I right? <laughs> my poster fell down again. Let's see if you can see it. Wait, hold on, is that a big Oh no, I thought that was a big money selfie poster. Oh no, I wish. No, it's a fucking Chipotle spicy wrap from Macca's. Why would you hang that on your wall willingly? Because <laughs> I work at Macca's. Really? Oh my god. I feel yeah, like it's a sad one. the ends of the spectrum though, because like, T is full autist, whereas you're like, subtle autism. And he's like, 110%. I got a poster for a promotion at my own fucking house. And he's had that hung for like three years. Oh, he loves his, he loves his wise. mick raps. I just enjoy the meme of having a fucking promotional poster up. I, the rap itself was shit house. The Chipotle steak wrap was garbage. I mean, wow. I, I made them. I just can't remember ever getting one. I think every time I made my own burger, it was just... So gross. The fact that you didn't it. even commit, you just hung it. That's even didn't even really like it. Doesn't even add it. He's like, uh, do. Uh, oh, oh, there oh, it goes. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, super big boy show, into? boys. It's the super big boy show. Yo, is that white wine? What was that? Perfect. That's not white wine. What? That's pink Moscato, sir. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Getting fucking classy, lit. boys. Classy. It's, oh, it's yeah. delicious. What can I say? I'm I, a I'd man's woman's boy's friend. You know, I'm. I'd rather delicious. be sober. Fuck that. I would that rather is, be sober. That is delicious. No oh, matter speaking of, what you say, I know it's good. So go fluff yourself. Speaking of quality, oh, see that old as fuck icon? Yeah, oh my god! Did you cut that fucking hole out yourself? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty fucking rough. <laughs> <laughs> but I got an app on my phone to turn it on. It's oh great. Oh my god! Oh, we're living in the future now, boys. I bought one of them Wi Fi PowerPoints. Oh, oh so god. good. Are you telling me you you fucked with the structural stability of your home? No. <laughs> That'd be ridiculous. I didn't cut any studs or anything. Oh my god! That's the best How... fucking thing ever! <laughs> How Wait, is there not on. a stud in that amount of space? That's like. Yeah, yeah, it's like also, 24 It, it also, fits how, perfectly how the, between them. Like, what the fuck is no supporting space. it? Please do not tell me the wall itself is supporting it. Ah, it's just plane. put it in the wall. Fine. Oh, don't worry about it. Dressing me out. Oh, the no, drywall no, is joking. supporting the no, way. It's, there's, a, there's a full fucking mount on the outside of the wall. <laughs> oh my Thank fucking god, Tia. That, that, that wall so goes outside. <laughs> oh my god, that's just gonna go dish, 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 dish through the wall one day. Right. What? No, if it's gonna fall, it's gonna fall backwards, outside. Oh and my just god. Leave a big <laughs> hole in my wall. I've got it mounted so it's slanting backwards. I know yeah. the answer, but I'm gonna ask anyway. Are you guys renting no. or do you own that no. house? Don't. Don't ask. It's not worth it. Also, if you asked, um, try asking with more packets this time. Yeah. <laughs> Are you renting that house? No. Oh. No, my housemate, um, owns it he inherited it from his grandpa and we've been oh, okay. since high school right. and then you terrorized it by putting a hole in the wall well it was his idea he's like hey i'm getting a new aircon for the lounge room you want the old one 
<laughs> Old Fuck one? Yeah. You know, the one from 1980s? Do you want that one? <laughs> you have hey, to man. pull the cable and fill it up with petrol manually? It makes, it makes the air cooler. <laughs> what more can I ask for? It makes the air cooler. What else can you ask for me? I mean, honestly, man, I can't talk. My air conditioner, it just stops at my door. I'll walk out my door and it's cold. And then I walk back into my office and it's warm again. It's fucking nightmarish. Yeah. <laughs> makes me want to kill myself. Yeah, that, that's the same with my office, but, you know, my excuse is I have a server and a fucking tower, and my gaming tower points directly at my fucking face. Well, I can't... Because, you know, I'm a oh. wanker and I want to be able to see all my LEDs in my case. That's Speaking of towers, I'm not sure if I showed you guys this before, but here's my fucking totally legit fucking setup. Cool. Totally um, legit setup. Don't show me your, like, nasty fucking cables again, dude. That was, like, one of the most... Oh, no, that's been fixed up. So, I'm getting fucking motion sicknesses watching your cam. Just so there's my, there's my disk drive. That's a bunch of spare space. No. Perfect for PS2 games. Oh, my fucking God. Are you putting fucking cases <laughs> in your computer? They're not touching any metal. No, they're just not creating airflow, you fucking autistic. No, there's a fucking... There's a big asshole underneath it as well. <laughs> well, okay, you can't see it on the camera. Oh, my God. The dust collection alone would be a fucking nightmare there. Oh. It's not. It really isn't. Cause I got I got this bad boy that I that I whip out every now and then. <laughs> oh okay, that's, that's just okay, that that's that's I hey, bet man, that was pleasant on as your you're dusting that regularly then. At least you've got yeah, that. No, I I do. I do. I'm not gonna lie, man, that's pretty horrifying. Like I'm ashamed just not having it. Horrifying is what I just watched. Oh my god! Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, so there's a subreddit um, called Military GIFs, and it's what it says on the tin. Yeah. So I was watched a GIF of uh, of Syrian rebels using a fucking trebuchet to launch an anti-tank mine for hundred meters. Are you Fuck serious? yes! Good I, on I'm him. not even shitting you. Give me a Fuck second. Yeah. Oh my god! Please put that in like one of the discords. We gotta watch uh, this right here and now. Right now, there's no way you can't. This is this is a trebuchet for a oh. mine. That's fucking insane. That's genius. No fucking way, dude. Oh, that's amazing. It's fucking terrifying. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, how can your people get questioned for intel when they don't know where the fuck it landed? Jesus. That is legitimately fucking scary. Oh, so good. I can't believe they trebuchet a fucking landmine. Dude, they're the Syrian rebels, man. They, they ain't got no... Oh, wait, that one's fine. There's uh, not safe for work. Yeah, I'm not gonna have a little gift. Oh my god. I mean, just... someone dies in that one. That's fucking genius. That's so genius. Boys, we need, we need, we need to launch something. How do we get this mine over there? Let's build a fucking trebuchet. Hop on YouTube. We can just find out how to build one on YouTube. Internet no man. <laughs> See now we need to shut down YouTube because it's helping fund terrorism with how to. Oh dude, don't, don't just don't even meme about that. I'm only you three episodes in, you, bro. You gotta make you gotta make me go down a path. I'm only three episodes in, so you don't say anything. Well, you guys haven't look, watched. All, all, all I'm saying is, if you don't shut down YouTube for helping terrorism, you gotta shut down Twitter as well. Dummy up, dummy up, no, no, no. Get over here, you little piece of shit. You don't get to what do you mean? They use almost every social network for recruitment. Like yes, dude. but also the social network behind Twitter is also... Uh, sorry, the people that own Twitter are Saudi Arabians. So it's in their best interest to keep it open. Did you say the people who own Twitter are Saudi Arabian? Yep. What? No, th are they I, I need this fact-checked. Somebody... <laughs> Give me a second. Here we go. I'll do a quick Google. So, Twitter owned um, Everybody Googles at the same time. Uh, big holdings oh. are, are detained Saudi prince a while in under pressure. What the fuck? Okay, so Saudi Prince Al Walid bin Talal owns the Rotana Media Entertainment conglomerate, Good and in late 2011, acquired a 300 million dollar stake in the social media site Twitter. So they have stake. Yes, I they probably have a, they, I'm assuming they probably have the controlling share. 
Prince, yeah, he doubles his stake in Twitter. Company originally invested 300 million in Twitter back in 2000 before it went public in 2013. Uh, that's insane! Holy shit! I had no idea. Yeah, so like, I, like, like, look, don't get me wrong, as much as I love conspiracy theory shit, because I find it hilarious to believe that sort of stuff, I do go through and fact check dumb cunt shit that said like that. Yeah, so he does. He actually owns, like, pretty much the entire thing. Yeah. And also the, uh... Do, 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 wow. Where are we? The executive chairman of it is a Iranian Kurdish uh, businessman. He's American, but he's Iranian Kurdish. So, you know... Look, I'm not gonna say he's... I'm not gonna say he's tied to terrorism. <laughs> Hold on. No, 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 no. Where are we? And that's how Sai loses his channel that he's had for eight years. No, 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 hey, no, no, no. Watch me play right. I was going to say, I'm, I can't be bothered doing, you know, actually <laughs> digging, digging his, all of his information up. But, you know, <laughs> allow, me, allow me to channel uh, Western Sydney here for a second. His name's got squigglies in it. That means he's a fucking terror. Are you serious? What's... <sighs> Stressing me out. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Like... I mean, anybody could insinuate a linkage to terrorism just because he's Irani. Well, but why would he invest so I, much I, in Twitter? Okay, okay, okay. Well, well, hold on. Let, let's put it this way. Technically, um, Twitter wait, hasn't well, find, did, found a way. did he move? Twitter hasn't found a way to properly monetize the platform. On. So why would you want to invest in something that you can't properly monetize? Never mind. That's he's thirteen. He was thirteen years old when he moved to America. Wait, hold on, when's the... Oh, fucking... Actually, you know what? That is... It's getting too dark for the fucking pod. Let me roast real quick? What's up, man? That's a good name. Shit. It's untrustworthy. <laughs> Gunny Zales. Whoa. No Australians? We're a, we're a rare bunch. Uh, I'll be back in a minute. Actually, Everyone's I'm... Uh... I'm full blood American, all right. I'm just a uh, special He's guest. Just a He's right. got freedom running through his veins. I got that red, white, and blue pumping through my veins, brother. Right Cake through, his br brother. Right through his veins, brother. Ah, but. Oh God damn it! Why? Why did you have to ruin the good thing? A goodwill teddy bear. <laughs> oh man! Ah, oh, have to time you out now. Why you got to do this, dog? I mean, look, my hair looks fantastic, and you're just angry because it grows so goddamn quickly. And Bro, that's actually goodwill. funny. It's so mean. <laughs> I had to time him out for 600 seconds for being a rude boy. What the fuck? <sighs> Why is everybody throwing shade at me today? This is bullshit. Second stream of the day, I'm just getting oh. cut up. I'm getting sliced up. So mean. Yeah, what kind of what kind of hairstyle do you prefer? Though? God damn, but I got AFK. Fully like shaven. Things. Someone gets timed out. What do I miss? What? Oh. What's up, downgraded Britain? What? What's the longest you've actually had your hair grow out, though? Oh, uh, man, it got pretty long, but I can't remember exactly how long. This is probably, in my adult <laughs> yeah, life, the longest I've let it grow. So it can get long enough where it, like, literally just is fucking everywhere. And it's like, even now, I can't dry it after I get out of the shower, which is too much for me. Less fat Seth Rogen? Oh, fucking take it! I'm okay with that. I'll roll with that. That's a compliment, motherfucker. <laughs> I'll take that, man. I'm Seth Rogen, except rich, but less fat. So I'll take it. Less fat, more artistic. I, you know, I'll take that as well. That's actually kind of fair. I know if you've heard Seth Rogen, the, what is it? <laughs> like, I can't do his Seth Rogen laugh. <laughs> oh God, no, I can't do it. <laughs> he constantly sounds like he's being like just stoned, but he is. But on the real, why does the guy above look like he collects katana blades? Because he fucking does. I mean, I literally, that doesn't even count. I literally have a katana blade back there. This dude drinking I think he's wine? Because I'm Tommy. fancy as fuck, dog. So fancy. Anyway, so can you believe that my $5 capture card um, has kicked the bucket? $5 capture card. Jesus Yeah, dog, Christ. I bought it off eBay. You want to see it? Yeah, man, of course I do. You like, <laughs> how long did it last you though? Uh, fucking fair while, and I'm sure I could probably fix it. Good but uh, we don't this sell is one. literally it. Oh, it's an easy cap. I had one of those and when I first it started. Goes YouTube. into RCA, dude. 
That's maybe beautiful. Yeah, fine. Well, what the fuck? It's Jesus Christ. Yeah, he's real. And we don't sell wine at 7 Eleven in Australia. We're alcoholics, but like. Yeah, that's weird, hey? Yeah, it's weird that we have alcoholism and ice problems, but we don't sell alcohol at a 7 Eleven. Like, what the fuck's going on? You have to go to just a fucking. School okay, shooter. Wait, he did it school once. Shooter? He only did it once. He was They're calling he him was, a school shooter, he, man. He was dismissed. He was dismissed. On all well, charges. Well, you are the only American. <laughs> Come on, Commissar. As if you didn't see that coming back. You can't That's serve brutal, the ball man. and not have the ball come back at you. Let's go the long hair, plays his guitar to underage girls and tries to seduce them. Yeah, keyword is trying. It's weird that he was like... It's weird that he was like, that it's guy looks like he, has, he collects katana blades, and then there's literally one behind me. It's like, like why? Uh, oh, my camera died. Yeah, big F's. Tries to seduce camera. them? Nah, he plays guitar to himself in the, in the mirror, and then touches himself friskily. Oh, God. Yo. Uh, anyway. R slash roast me. Also, it's a bass, not a guitar. R slash roast me? Yeah, bro. Let's hear it, guys. R slash roast me, do it. I mean, we already <sighs> kind of did. There's a lot of easy ones you can go for, but I'm... I'm pretty sure those were the ones we went with, yeah. I mean, those are the easiest ones. School shooter, less fat Seth Rogen, looks like he collects katana blades. Like, it's pretty weak, yeah, my like, dudes. <sighs> Oh, he he usually just fucking roast someone at least, you know, do something good, not just uh, you are bullshit up. Uh, I'm edgy. Uh. That's pretty much. That's pretty much the Step longest shit up. It's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, come put on. some effort in. You complimented me. <laughs> Autistic. If you're gonna come in with that weak shit, you're gonna get banned. That's pretty much. I it. literally every time somebody tries to roast me when I'm live, they're just like, "You look like a white KSI." A white KSI. Like, and I'm like, I don't really know who that is. I have to go look it up and be like, oh, I, I guess you're kind of showing so much chest hair. Motherfucker doesn't even have that much chest hair. This is weak as shit, man. Honestly, like, I come on the internet. I want somebody to fucking roast me. This is weak as fuck. Dude's trying so hard to right. Twitch thought. He is a Twitch thought. I might drop out. I'm just checking on my pizza. Do it. Yo, he's getting. Uh... He gets like DM'd by underage girls all the time, but he says no. Subscribe uh, so you can get my premium Snapchat if you know it. Yeah, 35 extra dollars, I'll send you a picture of my taint every day. <laughs> every day. It's a story. When yeah, you, you get ever had it? Come uh... on! That's fucking weak. You guys are so shit. Have you ever had a premium Snapchat sent to you? Oh, no. Whoops. Where did you... Where did you get hair from? Where did you get hair from? I don't know, man. How much was pulled out of your public education last year, you fucking loser? Oh my god. Right? If you're gonna, seriously, it. if you're gonna roast, do something useful, you fucking cum guzzling shit turd. Panda being the last person here. Panda, you got something better than you two friends? Because they were both fucking terrible. Oh, I wish I left the chat up on the stream. That would have been so good. This is like yeah, because, running the gauntlet of retard. It's crazy. Yeah, because anyone that's watching the VOD back now is just going to think that you're fucking spurging out enough. I am spurging out. Well, for anybody who made it this fucking day. far into this stream, which is like nearly an hour now, I'm telling you, like, we just had a couple of, like, really special ed motherfuckers come through with the most basic boy insults. Like, really not putting in effort. Yo, have you been running the podcast for the past hour? Oh, yeah, we're up to an hour and seven minutes. I think I was on getting started for 10 minutes. So, yeah, pretty much coming up to an hour. Yeah. It's so easy to talk shit for long periods of time. I don't know why everybody thinks yeah, it's uh, hard. It's too bad you didn't go offline on Steam. So now there's just constant fuck update to for your friends. <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, I'm doxing all my friends, like, Steams. <laughs> there's a dude there called Loose Seal. Like, I mean, who cares? <laughs> Honestly, this production quality is just too much for me, man. Honestly, I can't. I can't. It is. it is. It is almost too good. It's amazing, actually. No, I would. Speaking I, of too good, guess yeah. whose pizza's here? I assume yours, because unless you told another person is on my the street to have a good day or night. Did you say good day? Because it's. I, I said know. good day, despite the fact. Shut up! I'm drunk. Oh, Snapchat. 
Oh, never mind. I thought it was the I thought it was the chicka being chat through Snapchat. Oh man, I want some. Actually, I don't want anything. I'm all sated. Oh what? man, I got I got a fucking ripper to get into now, dog. I don't think I want to crush a bottle of wine. I was Ripping thinking about this. it, but I'm not going to. Yeah, don't be that guy. Don't be that guy. Uh, crush a bottle of bourbon or something. Like, Appreciate that tweet out. <laughs> Just naming yourself a special guest on the Super Big Boy show. <laughs> oh, it's my weapon. Next. Oh, Jesus Christ. Could, like, uh, at least let me have a little bit of fun with them, dude. Featherhead no, slaves. They're just, they're, it's, it's just like, like wow, fat guy ordered pizza. An original. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, I'm cool. fat and I ordered pizza because I'm drunk and can't go and get for. Like shit to make my own dinner. The irony Fuck. is, so many people are still sitting in the stream. Like, have you guys seen the fucking numbers? Considering, like, we've just had like a, an overflow of autism come through the stream. Like, people are sitting there. Like, after this six hundred seconds, after the six hundred seconds, oh, call him fat again. I'll I'll say he's got shit hair. It's so well, crazy. What are you, hey. Yeah. Why are we timing everybody out? I don't know what it says. Normal banter on Twitch. As far as I'm concerned, this is That's pretty PG-13 stuff, you know? Especially in the IRL category. There we go, I'll put it this up This isn't there. IRL, though. This is oh. talk show and podcast, which That's is even worse. the same worse. shit. Oh, uh, did it stop there? <laughs> oh yeah, no, that's it. Oh, what? It only gave me a couple of the actual people, though. I'll put it up there next to Ryan, because he doesn't have... Well, I'll put it next to you, because neither of you have a webcam. There you go. And we can put that up there and everybody can see. When you time people out, it gets deleted from the chat line. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, oh no, because a couple of them are still there. A couple of them are still there. Oh, come no, the, the only person there is the small panda because he hasn't been because he hasn't been timed out yet. <laughs> oh my god, shut up, you weeb. And that's a t like this is low grade. This is like low grade memeing. It's such trash. <laughs> Listen, man, you know, sloppy trolls got to come out of the woodwork. Yeah, from time I, to time. one sec. Uh, yeah, I don't know why you're timing only out, out your only viewers. No, man, it's okay, man. That's okay. I wonder who that is. Featherhead0416. Holy shit. This is just, this is fucking priceless right now. I it's almost like timing out viewers still keeps them as a viewer. Yeah, I'm Ooh. a bit confused. Yeah, act like a fucking retard. You're going to get treated like a fucking How's that grab you, kid? And just so you know, you are banned from talking in Coach Lives for 40, 43 seconds. Let me roast real quick. Yo, what's up, dog? You welcome back. How you doing there, buddy? These dudes don't have any guns. Yeah, it's and because, guess what? Yeah, because this weird thing happened. still alive. This weird thing happened. We had one shooting, and we decided let's not have that happen again. Not like America, Actually, yeah. which literally has statistically one shooting a week. Next. Actually, uh, I live in America, so I have lots of guns. <laughs> We're gonna be totally, totally accurate yeah, here. Yeah, guns. I mean, that's nah, okay. dude. My camera shut off way before getting roasted. Yeah, his life is a roast. I fucking know I'm fat. All right, my cheap shitty camera just shuts off every now and then. <laughs> his cute little peach fuzz. Mum must be proud. Of you finally going through puberty. Weak. You guys are like four people in that. You guys got like four people in that country though. Oh my god, you guys are fucking <laughs> terrible. This is so weak, dude. Dude top in the right. top right has his eyes in two different area codes. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, at least That's someone's good. stepping That's up. That's a solid That's roast. That's solid, bro. That's a solid there roast. You go. You're getting somewhere. Yeah, why did school shooter leave? Uh, oh shit, I was a school shooter. Yeah, apparently you're the school shooter. Oh, you have okay. Yeah, fuck your long hair to you. Your school shooter yeah, like status is improved apparently. It's Jesus and the school shooter. Right. <laughs> this is the one. <laughs> one good roast out of like five fucking people. Let's try. Wait, and... did you guys think I was the school shooter? Fuck, man. Yeah. Hey, man. No, I mean you have guns, so I mean it, it just kind of. Yeah, but. But I mean, I don't have like the long hair and like the world did me wrong look on my face, right? Yeah, but you, you don't have the look, but, but you, you are wearing, wearing a, a headband. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so what? So I'm what, are you, what are you? What are you? You're joking. profiling. You're profiling people who wear bandanas now. It's a fashion statement, all right? All right, man. Shit. This poor fashion statement. Keeps the hair out of my eyes, all right? My Jufro needs to be tamed somehow. Bro, hey, this dude. Anything that starts <laughs> off with bro, this dude is like instantly dismissed. Bro, this dude got an air mattress. Yeah, so when I go camping, fuck boy. 
Top left talks like he fucks. Come out, pussy. What? Oh, he wants you to turn on your webcam, Ryan. Um, yeah, here's <laughs> the thing. One, don't have a webcam, and two, I don't have these random fucking retards on the internet, so, eh. Hey, so I heard Red Bull is setting up a jump between the gap and your teeth. When's the stunt date? I don't know. Once they're done fucking your mom, I'll get in contact with them. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh it's so hard to roast oh. people. Fuck it. Are they uh, talking about your gap? I, let me see. Yeah, give, me, give me a big smile. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, one, it's not that bad. One single good burn out of everybody so far. It's not that bad. Yo, dude, it's like, literally there, not that bad. It's there are gone. gaps. There are gaps in between people's teeth. You could put a garden hose, and you know what I mean. Oh yeah. Have you seen like all those like lipstick commercials? Wait a minute. From, like, Hold on. The late like. Oh, oh, we have something's just uh. Yeah. Come, come up. Now who's the who, fucking back? Who the fuck is running game right now? Who is that? DM DM me on Discord. Love to see who that is. Oh man, that's if that's somebody we know, or at least knows Ryan, then Ryan, you've made some enemies. That's weird. I would have never expected you to ever piss anybody off. Fat oh. Jesus is right here, bud. My yeah. camera's shit the bed. Yeah, that's why I've gone. Fat Jesus is eating a pizza right now. Chill out. Well, like, I've got a couple of hunches, but... You know... That's a common excuse. My webcam isn't working. I know. I've been. He's just. He's just trying no, to I just flat out don't own a fucking webcam. Is you know. Avoid the shit show. Before, apparently. Before Twitch was a thing, what did you use webcam for? Pouring yourself. Are you trying to tell me you weren't a cam boy? Oh my god. Uh, motherfucker! No one would pay me. I mean. You don't know I that. Like you don't I know have that. To... Trust him. He tried. <laughs> <laughs> I end up having to pay fucking live jazz. <laughs> Listen, man, you know, there's a market for everything on the internet. It doesn't matter what you are. Uh, no matter how you, you look. To move out. Terrible. It's a bad. That's these guys. You guys are doing like We're trying to help you roast people. That pizza will fill that void in your sorry ass life. Again, it's just fucking I terrible. It's just... One burn out of like five autistic people on the internet. Like one good burn. And just because it's accurate doesn't mean it's a good burn. Yeah, exactly. Okay? He can't help it. Why do you think I ordered the pizza? I know it's going to fill that void, bitch. Exactly. It's going to fill that void. He's going to take a dangerous ass shit and then he's going to do it all again tomorrow. And that's okay. God. Next burn. It's fucking insane. Bro, so I've still never been... I've never been so humbled as to hear that my eyes are in different area codes. It's amazing. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> that is That's so good. good. <laughs> like nobody roasts me like that in my own stream. I fucking wish they would. <laughs> you, you, yeah, I know. Wish somebody would roast me that hard in my own stream. We hit a note with the bottom left. Bottom left replies what with, "I'm gonna enjoy this pizza." What oh, boys? I got him. He replied that he's gonna enjoy the pizza. I fucking got him, boys. His response means I win. Oh my god. I think as soon as you start talking shit to somebody on a stream, I think you've instantly lost. Bottom left fat. Fuck, he's not even trying. Just ban him, Ryan. He's obviously autistic, and we need to give him some love. Give him... Just give him a kick. Stick him in the arse. Got him. Man. 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 Everybody's going after Coach and people who don't even have their fucking webcams on banned for calling him fat spineless? it's not for calling literally. me fat if i was literally spineless thing. how did i stand up uh, medical because it's, it's like low science. fucking effort you said i literally Just... don't have a spine how would i have stood up and gone and got water which you haven't drank in like 40 fucking years you sad fuck <sighs> who's that hot dude on the top right there you go that's refresher for you Again, just What's like, poppin' Bosh? Damn, bro. By somebody else. There you go. You wanna slide into my DMs? I mean... He already did. He already did. You know he did. <clears throat> oh, I totally missed that. Damn, Ryan. I'm glad I got the chat off, though. Hey, so, if, like, anybody who's watching this on YouTube after, like, an hour and five minutes... My God, this is going so long. Uh, it's like... Honestly... 
this is just, just Twitch. This is like literally just Twitch. Like every day on Twitch is like, like this is why people don't respect the platform because people do shit like this. Are you implying that people respect live streaming on YouTube more? <laughs> no, I mean like, no, you make videos and you like don't even look at the comments. Like it makes no difference. Once you've made the content and you post it, you don't have to worry shit about the comments. It's at like, that point, you're talking about the difference between live streaming and video and video create like. Yeah, but if you make create. like, cause I get this, if you make a video, right? And you know, it's good cause you've done production value, right? And you post it. It's like you don't ever have to read the comments because but twitch is literally about interaction it's fucking crazy it's about wait top right has the same facial structure as lois griffin that's so good see that's a fucking great one. Oh man Fuck, dude. that's so good <laughs> that's so well, good I, let me get a solid picture for uh can do a frame by frame <laughs> that's great that's two good burns out of just like a whole, just a whole list of shit, that was one good. I mean, they're both Jewish. I'm not Jewish. I'm like, uh, I am. I yeah, but you're not the top right either. Yeah, it's a good point. Nobody's talking about me. Can somebody burn me, please? Because there's like some seriously yeah. lukewarm shit. Uh, I've got you, Chief. I've got you, Chief. All right, uh, go. You have small PP. Oh, oh, fuck. fuck. Oh, oh, how do you oh. recover from that? How do you recover from that? Oh, my God. There we go. The same small panda. How do you and, uh... recover from that? <laughs> oh, <it's Griffin>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking talking. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, that is just perfect. This is exactly the quality of content I want here on the Super Big Boy Show. The name is more fitting every second this goes on. Oh god. <laughs> I mean it's funny because I'm waiting for there to be a picture of Lost Griffin, but all I can see is Commissar. <laughs> Staring right back at me. He's so still. Oh my god. <sighs> That's fantastic. Yo, no objective gaming, what's up, baby? Oh, I should probably do some shout outs for some some of these kids. Uh, oh god. Shout out your mom. Got him. To you for, such a, for making such an amazing human being. There we go. You're welcome. We're all about that positivity here, bitch. <laughs> oh, god, there we go. He finally put a <laughs> selfie up, everybody. Oh, I'm trying to remember exactly what Commissar's tag is. I'm trying to remember now. It's Commissar something at the end. Commissar. Wow. Wow. Don't you fucking oh wow me. Okay. I'm I am legitimately. What is that? I can't like it's Commissar, but it's something at the end. I can't remember. SM, you is, fucking This is Jared. bullshit. It's I thought SM. we were friends. I am Even friends with I you. I remember it. Okay. Just because I can't remember your one name, but you remember my last 10 names doesn't mean shit about friendship. My well, one of us, one of us rebrands every three months. All right. Hey, <laughs> fuck you. I mean, it's true, but still. Oh god oh, damn. I've had this back when homeboy on the left turns their cam on. He fucking won't. And I hope you don't come back, you autistic fuck. Go back to the Whoa. god damn kid. Uh, I don't know. I had nothing after that. See, I can admit when I fucked up. Unless you guys throwing out like the weakest burns. Honestly, fucking warm water on my tits. How are you, man? All I'm right, doing really good. Where did trolls man. come from? Welcome to my. Uh... I want to fucking talk show podcast category. Welcome Rocky. to anything in IRL on Twitch. Roy right. Rocky Face Dennis? <clears throat> Roy Rocky Face Dennis. I feel like there's like something there. Is that supposed to be... No, I have nothing for that. Don't worry about it. Oh, Bosh, how are you going? Welcome you to feel like it's going to end its Did you see my tweet, <sighs> Bosh? Is that why you're here? <laughs> that's so... That's just deep. Oh, damn it. Now, now I've got to go find this fucking tweet. This whole stream has been such a pile of shit it's like episode one i'm gonna upload this to youtube and it's gonna be like oh hey hey psych tools finally put out no can't watch the guy anymore this is ridiculous who is fat jesus actually finally I... is fat jesus it's so fat basically jesus. long up, story boys? short we had about uh six trolls come in and throw out some of the most like just weak weak insults and there was maybe two good good ones and they were, they were both about comments. me they were both about him I mean, it's ironic because they're insulting the Jewish people, so anti-Semitism, you know? Just rolling Wait, out that what? Are you Jewish? What? 
Yeah, what? I am Jewish. But what? Jews have nothing to do with with having eyes yeah, in different no, area they codes. Just, they just they saw your curly hair and they instantly were like, "He must be Dude, Jewish." That's they instantly came in and went, "He must be Jewish." It's a huge leap, Chief. I mean, when I saw Commissar, I was like, "Hmm." You want some fuck, baby? Yes. I opened Twitch on my phone and saw the thumbnail, and had to come see what was happening. Ah oh, man, you missed the most, the biggest fucking shit show, dude. The I'm biggest... honestly just that recognizable of a face. I'm basically Leonardo DiCaprio. I People mean, look, see me, they're like, I mean, all right. You kind of. No, I'd say you're the next best Leo. You I look mean, a, like... actu actually on a real level. You look a, just a little bit like Leonardo DiCaprio. You, you know what? On, on a real level, I will say you are the most accessible Leonardo DiCaprio. The most accessible. Most accessible. Yeah. No, don't do it, Rocky. I liked you. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, he missed a G and he did a hard R. Oh, oh no. That, that, that's Niger. No, that's a country, Ni dude. Niger's that's a country, country in Africa, dog. Is that? Oh, man. Thank God. I thought he was just retarded. Oh, my God. Oh, well, I mean, yeah, you know, man. Look, I'm just... Give him time. Okay. Him Speaking time. of all fat Jesus. Oh, thank <laughs> God. I, I look, I really do feel like. Oh man, I'm either being he's I feel like he's baiting me in and then he's gonna eventually just like drop another one on Commissar. I think he's just gonna rock <laughs> Commissar one more time and then he'll just like peace out. Honestly, man, my body is ready. I'm just waiting. Three for three. Nobody ever puts you in your in your place. Everybody except for the other day when I was on your stream and you're like, God damn, this is just a shit show. Oh, Ligma! Okay guys, start giving up warnings and then start banning subs! He draws the line at Ligma. <laughs> <laughs> ban, ban one of my like 12 subs, guys, okay? Start handing them out because I can't take a joke. <clears throat> Y'all need to relax. Hey, so I'm starting a volleyball this season. What's the best knee guards? Bare knees. Train like a Muay Thai fighter and knee a tree every day 10 times. And then you'll have iron knees. And then you'll... That just sounds painful. Well, it does, but that's what that. they do. They train their... Uh... I have no more wine left. They train their... Um... What is it? They train their shins. That's why like, they have iron oh. shins. It sounds like bullshit to me, but apparently it's true. I feel like all you're going to do is just do like heaps of internal damage. like Progressively just like fracturing in your uh... your legs, but I uh, don't do Muay Thai. So. Well, yeah, that's, that's how it works. What you is fracture it, like you make very small fractures, then they heal a little bit stronger, and you just keep doing that. Yeah, but wouldn't that be like the same thing as like kind of you know how you get scar tissue? Wouldn't that be the same thing where like heaps of little fractures like kind of like opens? It I up don't know, mate. I'm fucking fat and apparently Christian. So what would I know about fucking martial arts? You are the least. Well, you know, know, the Middle East is pretty close to the East. It's somewhere near the middle of it. So. Yeah, you know. somewhere near the middle of it, around there. In that general vicinity. <laughs> yeah, like come on, Jay. General vicinity. Near it. It's nearer than ours. So well educated. Actually, no, no, Why it's not. Why do we not. keep money taking money out of public funding, like out of public education, every single year? Yo, uh, should we talk about a controversial topic? What Go do you guys think? It. Do it. You mean you mean actually discuss content on the podcast? <laughs> yeah, I, I was gonna say we could talk about VR, but. I mean, what do you have in mind? Oh, uh, alright, uh, give me just a second here, let me, let me find something. I'll just go on livestream fails real quick, that's a great way. On livestream what? Livestream fails? Oh the, my the god, yeah. I mean, what is it? It I, was like, only two months ago, there was a chick who was like, just straight up masturbating on stream. Wasn't taken down, thousands of people watching, and it just kept going. What's this? Oh, okay, on here's Twitch. a good one. Okay. All right, so uh, if you guys have ever heard of Mango with a zero at the end, uh, he's a, uh, I believe he does Super Smash Bros or something like that. But anyway, that's not yes, that's yes, not important. Yes, I, I, I know this one. Yeah, it's not important. But basically, he gets pretty shit face drunk a lot, uh, like a lot of content creators on the platform do. And he recently he like pretended to pass out, like he just was like, Ugh. just fell out of frame, right? and then ended stream like 30 minutes later anyway he caught a seven day ban for that now when he came back he he ended up uh talking about it it's a little weird that he got a seven day ban when you can beat the living shit out of your wife and get a three-day ban 
Yeah. Or you could take off your bra on stream, show your quote unquote hot knockers to the world, knockers. get a three day ban. Yeah. Yet, yet for passing out on stream, quote unquote, faking that he passed out on stream, it was a bit, by the way, seven day ban. Yeah. Uh, that being said, you know, there's also the uh, the train wreck situation where, uh, you know, train wrecks called his friend who was in the same room as him playfully the uh for lack of a better word the gay f word that shall not be named on twitch because uh you know you know without without enough context you can get in a lot of trouble for saying it yeah or uh you can be like wreckful and say that you'll have your entire somebody's entire family assassinated and not have any punishment <laughs> so it's, the question yeah, is to, to just just to loop back for a second because Oh, I got into such a fucking heated argument with a bunch of people over this old mate Fortnite streamer that belted the fuck out of his wife. Air quotes. Right there. Fucking air Oh. Oh. Camera spins around before he fucking hits her. And she yells like a little bitch. Fuck off. Fuck off. First things first. No proof wait, that he actually hit wait, her. Wait, wait, are you implying that she didn't actually get hit though? Oh, fuck yeah. 100%. I mean, like, the burden of I mean, like, on her to prove that she got the fucking shit smashed out of her. I mean, like, Fuck she's you. screaming and the kids are freaking yeah, out. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Did I just get hit? <laughs> Can you fucking prove anything? <laughs> I can't believe you're gonna debate this. I Fuck mean, you, like, I, am. I mean, realistically, I would say it was likely she got hit. I mean, I... you know. Oh, yeah, oh, okay. God. Likely, likely is not she did. Twitch, who is not a policing entity in any way, shape, or form, should be dealing in absolutes, not ifs, buts, or maybes. But well, this shit exploded overnight. I mean, they had to do oh, something. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. Our trash bag fucking sleazy account of fair TV shows over here fucking picked up on it and they're like, Fortnite turning everyone into violent criminals. Yeah, pretty much. They pretty much were like yeah. outright like, People are killing each other over this game. It's just when Al, like, oh my god, rubbing their little fucking paws together. Jesus Christ, that was a shit show. I guess, I guess at the end of the day, the question is, do you think that Twitch just arbitrarily dishes out punishments? Or yeah. do you think that... Pretty they, much, yeah. 100%. Oh, fuck yes. 100%, they have a fucking 18-sided die, and they throw that shit across the fucking <laughs> office and see what it lands on. No way that Twitch isn't just standing there like they're at a fucking craps table, just like... All right, what did he do? Uh, he, uh, uh, I don't know. He said the F gay word on stream. Lockdown ban, boys. He's been on here for 10 years. Fuck him. And then they just go, woman masturbating. Yo, two how's freaking band. out, bro? It's okay, two hour ban. She didn't, she, she didn't do anything bad. Like, how's freaking out, bro? I know he is. He, they just roll, <laughs> they just roll the die, bro. That's all they do. There is no... Like, um, my friend Session94 is like, he's like literally getting streamers to, um, like even bigger streamers to get on a bandwagon to basically like shit on Twitch because they haven't like favorited small, bigger streamers either. Even bigger streamers get banned for bullshit. So basically- Dude, you watch Session94 too? Dude, Session94 is pretty good. I like him. He's a cool guy. That guy's a pimp, dog. Oh, what have we got here? You can't prove anything about that. Wait, he's a dog and a pimp? <laughs> Fuck. Damn. Yeah, he gets all the bitches. Um, he, yeah. But yeah, the whole scenario, they, they rolled dice, man. There's no way there's... Like, the amount of dumb shit that's happened over all of last year, they straight up don't... They don't... They don't run things by situation by situation. In saying that... You saw something for one second? Because yeah, I accidentally turned my camera on instead of turning screen share off, and it showed the last frame it caught before the camera shut the bed. He was covered in pizza and jizz. I'll yeah. Everyone see it. Oh, um, hell yeah, man. That, that's how I want to go out covered in pizza and jizz. Ugh. But yeah, they are. Uh, they, yeah, I mean. <laughs> in, okay, so they're not Sounds doing like it. A good way to they're go. not doing it case by case and clearly blanket banning. But how do you monitor this many fucking streamers? Like, how do you legitimately you monitor this? You don't, you don't, don't monitor. You, don't. you have to do... 
Remember that time? You have to deal with the fact that you get reports, and once you get to the reports, then you need a consistent system to be able to deal out punishment. This is like, but this that doesn't is, happen. This is lol when it picked up and became huge. You cannot fucking police, and they can't police themselves. So what do you do? You fucking throw shit at him. Squeak, squeak. Indeed. No, I just, just share. No, I want to. No. Yeah, made your face real. What up, Tex? How you doing, baby? Uh, oh, boys. Oh, boy. Uh, oh, my. It's not really a major face. If you're talking about me, Tex, it's not major. I've done things in the past. Continuing with the whole fat Jesus thing, there was a time oh I ate God. an entire family burger box on stream. Fuck it, yeah, dog. He did that. Yeah, he did that. Because someone bought it for me. Yeah. 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 So, yeah, it doesn't mean shit. Like, you can't regulate this many people. Full stop. There's nothing you can do. Sure, you can. No, you can't. You can. I mean, well, robots can. Well, they've they brought up you know, the, idea, the idea of selecting like so many like highly trusted, um, highly trusted users to quietly nope. police. Yeah, no, that's nope, that doesn't work that, either. No, nope, that's a terrible idea. Straight up favoritism, bro, and straight up using that power to bring down streamers that are growing if they're in your category. Like, it's just gonna get like it's fucked. You can't like I can't. I, somebody said oh, somebody on a that was streaming said how much Twitch was grow, grew last year. Um, uh, give me a sec. <clears throat> Are you looking for statistics on how how much it's grown? Yeah, how many extra streamers we had this year? Oh my fucking! It's God. something like a factor of. Uh... I believe it's something like 40% growth in, in new broadcasts. Number of creators, number of creators monetizing on Twitch grew by 86% this year. Okay. I was going to say, that, like... Monetizing, you yeah. mean? Yep, yeah, they confirmed so that, that. That's just because they released the affiliate program, though. But... Yeah, true. It's true, but also, it's not super hard to get into the affiliate program. Exactly. Uh, well, uh, sorry, when they bought it out, I don't know if it's changed now. Um, Duke, I'm surprised you haven't hit it yet. What, affiliate? No, dude, because you need 50 followers. Um, uh, Among many various other goals, I've hit all of my other goals. The dang kush. I'm going to be a bit vague about it because I can't imagine that they're super happy about discussing their goals or whatever, but yeah. It's a blanket goal statement, though. Like, everybody has the same goals. Yeah. Pretty, like, everybody has the goal of just, like, you know, however many followers. But now that, that affiliate's in, it's like affiliate partner. Like, there's only two. There's only literally two goals unless you're, like, just a casual streamer. And it's so... It's 50 followers, yeah. seven, seven days and 30... Or seven days out of 30 streamed, 25 hours, I think. And yep. then... There you uh, go. Check, uh, three average check viewers. Just the TV 2.0. No, fuck. Okay, uh, yeah. YouTube grew in uh, three, uh, grew their streamer base by 343% in 2017. Teen, teen, uh, and Twitch, uh, Twitch. Okay, so in 2017, Twitch grew by 197%, and it's and it's definitely gone up since then too. So, uh, I mean, dude, it's. I think I. Who was like, fuck? I was talking to somebody today about this and yeah, while well, i was on my first stream about how it's oh yeah i was talking to tia about how like it doesn't matter if you do something unique because it's like you've got just got to like and it sounds harsh and fuck all of you i'm gonna say it there's a large group of subpar streamers within the 10 bracket that just like basically sit on top of yeah <laughs> yeah this fucking guy basic ass vapors who are sitting on top who are sitting on top of it like it is like there's a basic amount no i wouldn't even say 10 like people up to 20 viewers who have like the same fucking content it's like fortnite like i could stream through fortnite right now no i can look at fortnite should i yeah no no i'm not gonna no, no you that's shouldn't that's no. just gonna make you depressed it is so i mean you look at fortnite and it's just like a billion people under 25 viewers who are just like stacked on top of you and you're like hey i'm entertaining and i like fortnite and I can't grow because I've just got a bunch of people on top of me. It's just the platform's too big. Yeah, and they're like, "We like Fortnite. We like Fortnite." 
And like the worst thing is, is that Twitch goes, hey guys, we have these cool new creator camps now to teach you how to grow on Twitch. We know yo, 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 don't talk shit. people on top of you. Don't talk shit about creator camp. That shit's actually pretty cool. I mean, look, it's kind of good, but nothing you couldn't fucking Google. There's like 40 it's, thousand. Some of that shit articles. is super interesting though. Uh, like in all seriousness. So, um, I'll agree with like I'll a jump in right things. quick. My background noise is getting way too high, so I'm gonna dip the fuck out. All right. Uh, see bro why don't uh blah, 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 blah. why don't we create justin tv 2.0 i mean i would if it was a thing but it's not a thing unfortunately so it's kind of like what do you do i mean instagram live facebook like i'm surprised instagram hasn't hopped on li like live gaming my god the amount of money that would make on ad revenue if they would make a fucking fortune to integrate direct social media directly into gaming they would make so much money. Like, even Facebook already has, man. See you, dude, boy. Yeah, even Facebook's already made a fucking fortune. It seems like a really good idea, but... but Wait, Facebook... does Facebook have, like, a system to monetize through, like, a subscription type system? You can donate, but they run ads alongside of it. So, yeah. if somebody streams oh, for, like, okay. six hours, you can just run fucking ad after ad after ad. Like, they can, like, a fortune. They can make a fortune off that. But, yeah. So, I mean, like... I'm surprised Twitter hasn't done it, honestly. Like, Twitter is like... Twitter like, does have a, a live streaming service called Periscope. Periscope is shit. Why did they buy it? Periscope is, like, fucking horrible. It's a horrible streaming platform. It's so bad. I don't, I don't know anything about it. I've never used it. I just know that they have it. <laughs> it's bad. But it's there, and it's a mobile streaming platform yep. primarily. And that's why, why it's fucking thing. Uh, my OCD with the same size webcams and the T is just a blurry box, bro. Just a blurry box. I know, I know, I know, I know. Bosh, you should uh, get in on this this broadcast here so that we can quell Come the on OCD. In, boy. It's, uh, yeah, it'll make yeah, it we, four yeah. even spots. T is we need more yeah. people with webcams, yeah. you know? If Bosch comes in now, then we can make it four again. Then we can have four people and it'll force his into a 1280 aspect ratio. Sorry, resolution. That makes sense. But yeah, there's, I mean, like, yeah, you can't, it's, yeah. The site's too big, man. It's fucking huge, man. There's a reason why people like, are moving to YouTube and shit. They make content there and can stream there, so it kind of works out. Well, honestly, like, one of the biggest problems with Twitch right now, and one of the things that is complained about all the fucking time and has been for the past five years, is that the discoverability for, like, low-level streamers is just infinitesimally low. Yep. That's why places like Mixer, where they have like the uh, what's it called, the hype zone or whatever, that shit is like pretty cool. Yeah. Because it's just like you can randomly be chosen to basically be on the front page for a couple of minutes just yep. because you are, happen to be doing okay in whatever game you're playing. Yeah. Like it's curated by a human. It's not just you know automated. It's not automated. But that being said, like you know you get your you get your time in the spotlight whether or not you necessarily deserve it. Yeah, and I, and that's yeah. that's kind of cool because it gives everybody a little bit of hope. Whereas on Twitch, you have to kind of just really differentiate yourself. I mean, unless you're sitting there, you know, dancing in the background with like glow sticks on and shit like that, you're not going to get too much traffic just because you're like every other fucking asshole on the site. You know yeah. what I mean? Uh, the the problem with that with Mixer is like, sure, you get your you know few minutes of fame to the all other three people that use mixer <laughs> yeah you get your three minutes to fame to all five thousand people on the server on the freaking website site is so small man like people go it's a great place for small streamers yeah but it's also like there's maybe two full-time streamers on there because they're like it's all about interaction it's like you can't interact with enough people to make you a full-time income therefore it's kind of a joke to for people to move over there every time somebody's asked me I've been like, don't do it. Like, just don't do it. Like, if your goal is to go full time, unfortunately, Twitch is pretty much your only place. Like, yeah. YouTube, maybe, because they have a subscription service to channels now, but even then, well, that, YouTube's really sketch with how they monetize your actual videos. Mixer has subscription services. And in fact, it's actually a little bit more expensive. It's $6 numbers. instead of... It's numbers, though. That's not the problem. The no problem isn't that you yeah. can subscribe. It's that numbers. There's not enough people like the the chance of you even becoming a part-time like paid streamer on twitch is the same chance as you becoming a full-time streamer on mixer because on mixer there's not enough people to make you full-time but then on twitch the chance of you 
becoming part-time from enough people is also just as low the difference is is that you're in a small pond with a lot of fish rather than being in a small pond with a few fish but those few fish can only pay you so much so if we're talking about being able to monetize on a large scale you just fucking can't on mixer you just can't like look at the numbers look at the amount of people like watching it's just not possible it like it just by by numbers by payment there's not enough money to make well from to mixer. be fair you you could do it but you'd have to basically be the equivalent of like mixer's doctor disrespect like overnight you know what i mean that's the only yeah. way you'd be able to do it Thanks, in which case you'd have you know 300 500 concurrent viewers on average because the one of the biggest reasons why people go to mixer in the first place is because either a they have a chip on their shoulder about twitch for some reason or b they're straight up banned from the platform entirely like to the point where they couldn't you know they couldn't actually spend time on there if they wanted to and you know that's basically what separates people uh in t between twitch and uh oh my god botch is low res <laughs> low res is fuck that mustache dude you still oh, have it he the still porn stash the is mustache. so funny dude why why would you expect me not to have it i don't know man are you gonna go drop off some pies to next door because they're sick right now or are you gonna go to sunday are you gonna go to church are you gonna go to church i mean maybe are you maybe gonna go, go to, to both church? uh early morning and midnight mass as well gotta get yeah. your god in i'm gotta I'm get your PG. god in i'm a pg christian streamer so minecraft do you do minecraft do you host your own server Oh, no. Guys, we should do a Minecraft stream. <laughs> um, Minecraft. I would hide in my shell if I made it to the hype zone. Dude, I thought I literally considered streaming on Mixer because I played so much Siege at the time and our Siege games always came down to like the final Mixer. wire. And I was like, I could stream on Mixer and play Siege exclusively. And then weren't there weren't Siege streamers. You used to stream on Beam when it was Beam, right? Yeah, I'm the OG. I literally, if I go on my profile, my profile actually comes up with OG streamer. And I'm like, I'm glad we sick. heard two words. Yeah, you cut out there. I have OG streamer on my mixer profile because I used to stream on Beam. So, wow. I, but anything Microsoft or any other large conglomerate touches, they I didn't realize we, we, we were dealing with an OG. I Sorry. am an OG. <laughs> Don't <fucking> excuse me, <laughs> sir. Back Please. up, sir. Respect the profile. <laughs> um, that's sexy, dude. It's super sexy. I can't man, believe you still have it. I respect that you still have that mustache. I respect yeah, that you like, still have it so like, much. It's like two months in now. That's thick. Literally a thick it's mustache. Looking better every, every, every day. It's this. <laughs> it looks different. It looks darker here because I don't have my lights on. Which is so weird that you're here right now. Shouldn't you be eating dinner and go to bed? Shouldn't I be what? Eating dinner and going to bed. It's only 8 o'clock. You could take the kids to school tomorrow. <laughs> oh, you gotta take the kids from school. Oh my god, wear oh, the fedora. Yeah. Wear the fedora, please. Have you got oh the fedora? My god. Oh god, okay. <laughs> this is the best first stream for the Super Big Boy show. <laughs> yes! It's so like, fun. It's it is one of the most fun oh. fedoras I've ever seen. Content, boys. Content. It's because it's, it's not made of anything that's like. It's like. I don't know what it's made of, but it doesn't hold up very well. Is it yeah, made of I like it. cane? It's like not cane. It's, it's almost like... yeah, like it's almost like fake wood. <laughs> like it's it's not even a fedora. It's got holes in it. Fake wood. Fake Did you wood. Just say... <laughs> it's yeah. like like a like a straw. Hat it's almost like a yeah, almost a straw, but like a fake straw. It's like seven dollars from Kmart. So. Oh, man. oh, I know exactly the one you're talking about. Then that was yeah. the best display picture I've ever seen on on Twitter. It just randomly. It's still my display photo. picture. Is it still yours? Yeah. I was off Twitter for like ages because I like focused on Instagram because I'm apparently only able to do one thing. It's either Twitch, Instagram, or Twitter. I can only Come do one at a time. Commissar took that screenshot and sent it to me. Yeah, he was, oh, he was yeah, sitting in front of his green screen for like five seconds one insane. time wearing that. And I was like, oh my God, that's actually amazing. So I just <laughs> I took it into Photoshop and like 90 seconds later sent it back to him. And he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> Man. I'm trying to find I saw you streaming um, <clears throat> fucking L.A. Noir the other day, but I was out of the house and I was so shattered I missed it. I finished the game, yeah. Ah, it was like two, two streams worth of content that I finished. So oh my god, yes! <laughs> Boys, I can go pub stomp on black free Black Ops 4 Blackout Trial starts this week. Hell yeah, dog. What? Don't oh, you own maybe? 
Yeah, but that means people that don't own it will get it to play oh, Blackout for like true. a weekend. That's Week like of content! <laughs> oh man, that game was so good. Oh, so it dead. was so good and it died way quicker than I thought it would. Nah, PC well, community just didn't have like a, a bar of how fucking yeah, dodgy blackout, that, yeah. compu that company is. You better be posting lewd pics on Instagram. Hey, if you guys haven't followed me on Instagram, I don't post very often, so it's kind of a waste of time if you do follow, but... Do I even have an Instagram? Motherfucker, you barely use your Twitter. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, no, I T, T uses his Twitter a lot. He retweets like a hundred things a day. So, no, I retweet like a hundred things when I use it like once or twice a week. He yeah, I see them retweet. all the time. It's like, there's like a big streak of TS streams retweeted. Yeah, he just retweets three weeks, weeks of content. Like every And it's weeks. generally all from GIF House. Let's, oh, let's you know, oh my god, it's so funny. I like GIF House. Fucking love GIF House. And so, let me bring up some real shit because as we approach its release date, Anthem. Anthem. It looks so funny. I, I like haven't... Warframe Cross Destiny is the only way that I can see that game. Every time I've seen ga gameplay. It just, I haven't seen it, a single bit of gameplay. Bro, it's third person destiny <laughs> flying okay. around so putting up numbers it's just it's the same thing uh, kinda i've seen about five seconds and it's like mm -hmm. okay I'll so try it when the beta rolls around open world three uh it's open world third person destiny that's like probably the best way that i can encapsulate that whole thing like as soon considering as considering the started, fact yeah Considering the fact that I didn't even like Destiny that much, I probably won't give a shit. I played Destiny for <laughs> yeah, free bad. and I was like three hours in. I'm like, oh god, I could do anything else with my fucking time than just yeah. shoot points Destiny at people. Is that, like, man, it's for me. I enjoyed Destiny like at that weird middle point between after the campaign but before the raids, like that small chunk of just stuff. Yeah, was There's enjoyable to, to me. Yeah, I can see uh, why people it, it enjoyed like, it, but... I think they fixed it now. I think there's more stuff to do, but... Yeah. I'm I enjoyed the pay. stuff before Endgame, but post... I'm not gonna pay, shit, like, gonna $70 for an expansion pack. I think yeah, it's gonna that's be bad. Yeah. I think it's gonna be bad, and I don't... I'm really scared that people are gonna... And it sounds weird to be scared, but, like, I've been so outspoken about pre-ordering and about dlc and about microtransactions for so long and i'm scared that like this game is supposed to kill a development team and i don't want to sound mean to the developers i don't want to sound mean to the crew i don't want to sound mean to the staff but like <laughs> this game should kill that fucking company sorry it's a fucking it looks so fucking boring it looks like i'm gonna pay 80 to 90 dollars so I can fly around making numbers over about, creatures' heads, man. That's what it looks like. Are we talking about Anthem or Destiny? Anthem. Anthem. Destiny, okay. for some fucking reason, is still just so popular, but no. Well, the newest expansion for that game was well-received, and yeah. the community quite like it. It was well-received by people that love Destiny. I... I will object to I Again, love I Destiny didn't like... One. Dude, Destiny... I will fight to the death. Destiny 1, at the end of its life, was a fucking incredible game. The problem with the, the difference is that, like, Destiny 1 was so good by the end, and then Destiny 2 came out, and it was like Destiny 1 when Destiny 1 came out. Yeah. Like, they learned it, n absolutely nothing. Well, there were different teams that worked on them. That's yeah. why. Um, I so, think the yeah. team that put out Destiny 1 and the first expansion did Destiny 2? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't I, know. I can't remember. I but, think you're the but, only one with enough knowledge on the development of uh, the game. The, the point is, like, yep. D D1 and D2 had different teams, and that's why D2 was shit at launch, and is still not fantastic. But Realistically, this... though, there's no way that, that Destiny 2 could have been as shitty as Destiny 1, because Destiny 1 didn't even have any lore or story. No, Destiny <laughs> 1 had a shit ton of lore. Oh kidding? my god, you had to go look at cards online to yes. find out what the lore Admittedly. was. That's bullshit. See, I'll pay, <laughs> I'll pay and that, I agree. I'll pay that text. I'll pay that text. Good for campaign. I'll pay that. Look, if the game is good for campaign... No, 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 after the campaign. I wouldn't... Well, he reckons it's good for the campaign. And no, I know Destiny... He says he after. Said, but it's yeah. when fucking Doog said, no, nah, the game's good in late game. I'm like, so I have to play... 30 fucking hours before it's I start enjoying it. It's fucking stupid. It's I shouldn't grind to enjoy it. 
but everyone said it's better now. Yeah, maybe, but the meme, this... yeah, the meme in D one was when the guy goes, "Oh, there was a massive war or whatever." But I'm not oh. going to tell you about that. <laughs> We're like, I could well, that, tell that you that wasn't about even the part. shittiest part. Like, the shitty part little? was how your spark is constantly like, "All right, give me just a second here." All right, this is going to take just another second. We got we got enemies incoming. <laughs> I'm unlocking the door now. And you're like, okay. And then you finally unlock the door and you go through another 15 minutes and you're like, all right, looks like we got a computer we need to hack. Give me just a second. <laughs> all right. All right, we're almost through. It's like, <laughs> it's like, what are we doing? What is the point of all this shit? I know that was literally like one of the biggest reasons why why my friend didn't like it. Yeah. I personally hated it because as as an occupational game tester, it was the shittiest goddamn 500 million dollar experience i have ever have exp ever had to trudge through in my entire life like seriously i'll never forget the moment where i was like trying to go through like this one area it's like this long deserty area and like i was like somewhere on earth if i remember correctly or maybe even mars and i'm like flying around on my speeder bike and i'm like oh i want to go over there even though it wasn't quite where my objective was literally launched out of the map because i went too far out of bounds and it's like yeah. oh okay so what you're telling me is that they decided to straight up go out of their way to make a texture of yeah. of a long plane and a long you know long distance meme, like plateau yeah. or whatever the meme was playa. Really they announced the game. They're like, "See those mountains over there? You can go there." Exactly. Like, yeah. Oh my god. And it was like, like, "Oh wait, no, you can't." Sorry. It's like No Man's Sky. It's like fucking Fable, man. All it's of them like... have been oversold, and people yeah. are like, "What the fuck?" And people are like, "Hey, don't get so angry. You know, it was a conceptual idea." No, motherfucker, you said I could do that, and then I bought the game for that reason, and then you didn't give it to me, and then you're like, "Oh well, you better buy our next game." It's just like there's needs to be the a shake is... up, bro. It wasn't even a conceptual idea. This was a five hundred million dollar development cycle game. That's bigger than some gross domestic uh, products uh, of certain I, countries, I'll, man. Yeah. Correct you there. Yes, the budget was huge for the first game, but it wasn't five hundred million. Five hundred million was the contract between Activision and Bungie for. I Wish think it was got tore up. Ten. Yeah. It did. <laughs> Thank fuck. But it was between <laughs> over like ten or twenty years of Destiny ten, content. I think it was ten years. 10 yeah. years though it wasn't it was just a, it was a t it was a 10 year three game contract 10 yeah. years three games how do you pre like how do you pre-plan that amount, amount of money it's gonna kill boys it doesn't fucking matter we're just gonna we're not gonna go contract by well, contract we are going to fast and furious the, this fucking series at the, so hard at the time bungie did have a lot of credibility coming had, out of halo had a lot of credibility coming out out of like yeah yeah legitimately the only plus i could give that game like, was like it, it looked really good it was pretty from a technical you know? standpoint <laughs> both games are great they're mechanically they're very well made yeah. like the, the the controls are really clean like yeah, the, the, the gameplay was nice enough you know when it comes down to gameplay it's a nice fucking clean enjoyable shooter Skyrim but is clean. The Plenty of storylines. It no, Does it no, need it's to not. be put in You're, every you, single you were, console, bro? You were saying a Bethesda game is clean, and that's blatantly no, wrong. That's all right. No, Just, okay. Right. Let me. I'm gonna make something very fucking straight here. Okay, they have bugs, no doubt, but they've never been especially. But they've never been especially game breaking, dude. They've never. You and I have bought every single, nearly every single Fallout and. The and giants hitting you into the sky. That's oh, that's game. not hilarious. That's, not, that's, that's literally not, not game breaking. That's, that's by hilarious. design. It's what by design. A bug that somebody no, complained a about. A bug that somebody complained okay. about. I found a hilarious. piece of meat spinning. And then on the day one of Fallout 4, I found a piece of meat spinning. I found a box spinning. I found a head spinning. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, and did I complain about that shit? No. I posted on YouTube because no. it's fucking Those hilarious. Those are hilarious. <laughs> like, They're the hilarious ones. There are game breaking, just like fatal, hard crash bugs. I've Things never that experienced kill you these. Be considered game I legitimately have not, like, maybe one or twice, two at times. But, like, at the same time, man, like, it's. I mean, you could say it, but in saying that, I won't defend Bethesda because they have, like, just. just well, they've, they've just shit themselves. They've so. just, like, they've yeah. just re released Skyrim 40 times. Like, they've just, That's like. Because they'll know, they know they'll make money doing it. Yeah, but, like, like how, poor is, stuff next. how poor is that to, like, treat your entire player base? And, like, look, the player base is clearly idiots because a lot of people bought the same copy, copy seven times. 
But the point is, is I bought it three times anyway. Fucking hell, Bosch. The point is, is that I, like, hey, I, will, I will defend Skyrim to, to buying Skyrim three times, just like I bought GTA Five three three times. They're great games. Well, the, the difference with GTA Five is that it was released it, specifically was, on consoles first, specifically on the old gen 360 PS3 consoles. Yeah. And then they release released it on the PC, on and then they released it on Xbox One and PS. Yeah. It went, I think it the entire generation. It moved every re release. They specifically re released it for like the newer consoles. Like, there's not much difference there. No, but with GTA, each release on the new console had a fucking like performance and visual the, yeah, upgrade. Yeah, to be fair, upgrade. To be fair, you, it was very much an upgrade. Edition. Like, the only reason that I even bought it a <laughs> second time for for the PlayStation or for the Xbox One was because like. It had great graphical upgrades, and you could play in first-person mode, and online had 32-player maximum. I mean, it was yeah. pretty cool at the time, you know? Like Yeah, but look at what GTA's turned into. It's a f I go into a free lobby, oh, now it's it's a fucking superbikes blowing me up. There's look. fucking tanks everywhere. There's a fucking it's DeLorean. Like, it's so goddamn dumb. Am I in Saints Row, motherfucker? Am I playing Saints Row? It's Saints Row now, man. It's Saints and Row. And it's great. No, I still fucking love GTA. it's autistic as fuck, Tia. They have That's sold why you... I love it. Oh, God. They've just <laughs> literally microtransactioned. Or, or sorry. No, they haven't. Uh, no. They've, they they have a premium fucking currency. And they've made everything so expensive. And it's so hard to make that premium currency. That <clears> people <throat> end up buying shark cards. Or people start hacking. I it's either of the two. I personally uh, don't think it's very it. hard to make that currency. What I don't I like do. is that... I, I've never had a problem. I make like a million dollars every few hours if I'm if I'm doing the right. Oh, you're like, fucking hell! Oh my god, what did I just? Well, I, I mean, just said hacking. Don't <laughs> make it hell like you're a normal fucking dude. <laughs> I hit up the Seven Eleven. They had five hundred thousand. It was so weird. Like, <laughs> <laughs> so my biggest problem with with modern day GTA Online is like the fact that there that special feeling of when you originally played you're like oh dude i gotta get myself like a garage or something so i don't get killed every on every street corner yep. i need a i need a nice car so i you know can can run away from people if they're trying to fuck me up or catch somebody if they stuff like that was like fun and it, it gave you something to work towards yep. nowadays what you work towards is like oh i need that super yacht bro <laughs> i need my four i need my fourth house bro like oh man fourth house you can own up to like eight or nine properties now oh, well it's just it's ridiculous because there's nothing really to work for that isn't just like the same old bullshit it's nightclub, like a cheesy yeah, a yeah it's like a yeah, cheesy ass car yeah. or like well, the night the nightclub was actually a pretty much a breath of fresh air for me. I had a lot of fun oh, yeah. doing that. Up. Yeah, well, like, like I mean, it's like on 360 when I got it after I waited two full days for the service to stabilize, oh, and weird. I sat there yeah. and I have a picture from Facebook. Best. Bosch would have been the only person who saw it, where I was like, put in GTA, loads up, and I'm just sitting there in a waiting screen. I'm like, okay, yeah, I'll play League of Legends. Oh, the service is down. I'm like, actually, what do speaking I? Speaking of that, I had a fucking... bunch of Facebook memories the other day from you uh posting up error codes from black ops 2 oh non-stop bro <laughs> non-stop over and he was over like again. five in a row like here's another one here's another one it's not this like, one's oh, new fuck. what did i pay I for this what did i pay for the error code simulator like um I'm just no, scrolling but, like, through these things on my phone i'm like man that's funny oh man what a dipshit i can't believe i'm friends with him i like the problem that was like i agree with you though commissar when i started i started and I picked up a muscle car and I robbed a store to pay for the insurance, ironically enough, to pay for the insurance on my car. Then I used that car to do a couple of small jobs and do a couple of death matches. Then I afforded an apartment to park my car and save. Then some jobs came out. I did some more jobs to make some more money. And then we now have supercars and million dollar fucking apartments. And I'm like, there's no like starting small anymore because you can't. Because there's not enough like people online. It's the payouts just... were never enough to like justify the price of everything like you do a job and you get like 10 grand and it's like okay between well... 10 and 30 grand depending yeah, on yeah but that's what back in the day was. that's back in the day when a garage cost 65 i mean it wasn't that big of a but deal. nowadays it's the the job pro the job rewards haven't changed and the all of the cars are like a million plus yeah uh, no the the new arena mode actually pays pretty well okay i haven't played it in like a year other than the one time i tried to play with comp I kind of feel like the way that it's gone, that it, it has a, it has a, it has a, Jesus Christ. It has a limited, I think it has a limited lifespan. I think, I think they need to be working towards something at this stage because 
I know I know a fair few people who are kind of like who are who don't want to hack because I don't re I don't want to hack, man. I don't want, I wanted to earn all the stuff in the game, but they've made they've intentionally made it so sometimes overpriced. You, sometimes you can't avoid it though, because like some yeah. Russian dude will just fly over you and drop money on your head. Yeah, so, yeah, they, dude, that's the scariest part. <laughs> yeah, then they ban your account, and you're like, wait, uh, the, a man shot me with a gun that shoots money bags. Like I had no choice. <laughs> Focus to the Rocky, get away from me! Like it's just like get away from me, money man. I was in my own home. Yeah, like, it's like the Willy Wonka of fucking money. money bags, man. Teleports into your room, gives you like two million and leaves you like, oh no, it's dirty money. It's dirty money! Like, I need to get it's rid of this! Kinda, it's kind of nice that nowadays... Give you money. <laughs> nowadays, they actually, like, will just remove the the funds from your account. Yeah. But, like, for a long time, it was like anybody who was even remotely involved. You were in the same lobby as a hacker. Oh, guess what? You're gonna have to rebuy the game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Fuck you. But it's, uh, but yeah, no, like, man, we fucking spurred off so hard. Like, I think Anthem, for what it is, I don't think people should buy Oh, it. right, we talked about yeah, that. That's right. I don't think people should pay $90 to get something they've experienced in Warframes for free and then they've bought in Destiny twice. I don't think people should be, like, going out, like, I, spending your money or your parents' fucking money on a game that you've already played. You've literally already played it. It looks like it looks just it looks like fucking destiny dude it just okay. looks almost the you same. Can say the same thing about grand theft auto they're all the same formula yeah but grand yeah. theft auto has a unique fucking play style it has a unique ability mm -hmm. to jesus Christ, it's a, it has a unique ability to give you a new kid experience an open world sandbox where you can collect cars and shit if we're talking about an autistic person to my left then we're talking about you not getting ex a, a unique scenario giving you an absolute monster amount of grind isn't unique gameplay it's not worth 90 dollars. it's just not here okay i'm gonna play devil's advocate here. playing down my fucking opinion uh, with your goddamn no. stuff dog you here's the shit. thing <laughs> <laughs> so there's yep. not a single bioware game that i have played through and enjoyed okay yeah, but dude i tried he doesn't i like tried it. so hard to like mass effect he has just... i was there when that motherfucker tried to play free versions of the game uh, no i've got it on i've got mass effect one and two on steam that's what i mean um, he's bought it or downloaded it and he just just and this is a man who loves I'm, sci-fi I'm just, I'm just asking I, I love sci-fi i love rpgs i by all fucking measures i should love mass effect and i just don't i don't care for dragon age i fucking love high fantasy but the point is i like dragon age one um, one and two. You know what's a really good Bioware like game besides Knights of the Old Republic, which are also really good. But yeah. you know what's a really good Bioware game? Jade. It's very Jade underrated though. Jade Most Empire. people have never played. It it's came out after Kotor, but before Mass Effect. Oh, Kotor yeah. two. Oh, the perfect. That was Obsidian. I'm not talking about developers. Shut down. I'm okay. no. I'm saying it's one of the best okay, sci-fi. It's Thank one you, of the wrong. best sci-fi games ever made, easily easily but anyway go on to your go to one spot so. okay oh, yeah okay, okay. prefacing this with i don't give a shit about bioware <laughs> games haven't enjoyed any of them but people seem to love them for the character interactions in the story yep. so would it not make sense that anthem even though it's probably going to be this grand whole online mmo thing would also have a decent campaign and character look interactions at, like, and look at like the old the old republic right but doesn't yeah. that game have a story and it's the same mmo but it's yeah. intentionally an MMO. This is going to be a pseudo inst like they're saying open world. It's going to be a pseudo instance based okay, MMO. Okay, you're cutting out with the fucking you keep, everything you're setting out. It's going to be a pseudo instance MMO. It's going yeah, to be going to be just like Destiny. Fucking yeah. Then why the fuck would you buy it? It's the same fucking game. Because Seriously. It's, not it. it's the same game. Maybe it'll be better than Destiny. It'll be better than Destiny. It oh, might maybe. be the same It'll gameplay. be better than Destiny. Jesus. It'll be a little bit like Warframe. Oh wait, no, it'll be a little bit like Destiny. Oh wait, it'll be a Destiny not... Warframe fucking incest child. I'm because not it's the talking same about thing. the gameplay. I'm talking about the single player experience potential. So should we continue giving money to a company that has proven time and time again, it gives no fucks about the long-term experience of the players because wait. I'm going to enjoy a fucking six hour Bioware? campaign. Wait, who's releasing Anthem again? I don't actually know. Anthem's Bioware. uh being yeah. it's Bioware's developing Anthem, EA is publishing. Bioware is literally like if we if this isn't a success, we go down. 
and fucking they should sorry like they just should like we like the standard of games the standard of experience and the standard of pricing in games right now is a fucking joke like like you've got indie developers who are clearly putting out a better product at a cheaper price and putting more effort into it like across so the because, board so Shout games used to, to be made with yeah risk like old games used to be made with soul like mm. it was a passion project first and and a money grubbing you know experience that's why like nowadays they all feel so fucking soulless is because it's just like all right we're giving you two years in this budget make it yeah you know we got here's we got the, this the number of writers goals. you have to make yeah this exactly cash Yep. Whereas indie developers know what they want and they they put the effort towards it with the notion not that they're going to make boatloads of money, but that they will have a reputation. They'll get clout in the gaming community for yep. what they. And they and the bigger thing is that they don't make it for the money, but they know that they can't make a piece of shit. They can't make a half game to DLC the second half. They can't make a game relying on microtransactions because if they don't put out a good game where people buy it, they get the whole fucking game, they get the full experience that they paid for, then that one game could be the difference between keeping the lights on. So, and then you've got AAA titles who are massively funded and they're like, well, that shit the bet, we'll do another piece of shit and hope people would pick that up or that one didn't make as much, but we made enough money to make another fucking piece of shit. Like, it's just... Uh, like a revolving door where there's a large pocket of money that is allowing them to just keep putting out shit over and over again. And I, that's uh, why I don't want Anthem to fucking make it because I don't think it's deserving. Like, I don't think we should all be so fucking happy with the status quo, which is exactly what this is. Like, games used to come out and used to go like, fucking hell, the graphics. That is next level. Now these days, it's like everything is nice graphics with like this fucking bullshit filler where you have to grind gear and then but the campaign's good so it's worth 90 dollars. but the rest of the game's shit then don't fuck it shouldn't like shouldn't gamers well, be trying to make a statement by not putting money into games and companies that clearly don't care in the past that's what a I'm good saying. example of that in my opinion would be um like the modern day equivalent of ubisoft and assassin's creed so like if you remember assassin's creed one was like a really crazy idea not very well executed but really crazy idea mm. and people liked it for what it was assassin's creed 2 was an extremely polished version of assassin's creed one yeah. assassin's creed 3 was assassin's creed 2 in mechanics but kind of a shitty storyline so it didn't really get very good reviews uh number four was just it was all right you know they they added boats and stuff like that so that was cool but then, like, you go all the way on to the point where it was like they got Rogue, they got Syndicate, they got Unity, and none of these, nobody gave a shit about any of those, right? And then they just stopped. They stopped making Assassin's Creed games for, like, th like two or three years or something like that until all of a sudden they came out with Origins. And Origins, people were like, yeah, it's all right. It's all right. But it wasn't Odyssey. Odyssey came out and it destroyed everybody's perception of the old Assassin's Creed. It's not even the same game anymore. It's closer it's not, to something like Shadows of War. It's not even Assassin's Creed anymore. Yeah, yeah, it's basically not even Assassin. And that's the thing. He doesn't you have, have the to play. They don't like jump on people from like rooftops and shit. Like, well, no, you can do everything that you could do in the old Assassin's Creed game. But yeah, you're right. You don't have the hidden blade. You have the spear of Leonidas, which is not near. But like, yeah, no, nearly as cool. But I mean, cool. at the same time, it's not in any way an Assassin's Creed game in in the sense that the gameplay itself is reminiscent of Assassin's Creed. The mechanics are, but the gameplay is very much something like Shadows of Mordor or The Witcher Three or something like that. And that's the thing: you have to adapt to the gaming market if you want to stay relevant. Yeah, they knew that. They figured it out, and now they're back on top. They only kept Assassin's Creed because of its name. That's that's the only reason. Yeah, but it I has. I'm... Yeah. It has notoriety and people know it, so let's keep it that and just change the gameplay. Yeah. It's just brand recognition. I mean, I've said the same thing about Ubisoft plenty of times. I don't. I feel like they've got like all these IPs, and you kind of think like, <sighs> you think of like another company that could have done better than them, and like that's how I constantly feel like they've got like the Tom Clancy like name and like, oh my fucking god division was a pile of shit and people like division two will be better and i'm like i don't think it will because i thought like i thought for honor which but on its release as a beta everybody was like 
this fucking game is completely unique, completely on We've, its own. We level. were fucking saying that. Yeah, at the we. Beta. Everybody was like, "This is fucking amazing! Like, this has every ability to be a completely unique esports experience." And then the game comes out, no dedicated servers, it has like almost no coverage as far as like any type of support. They're updating like every fucking three weeks. Like they killed their game, and now they're like, "We've fixed it, guys." Also, you have to pay for DLC now that the game's good. It's just like that Wait, kind of for shit. Division? No, 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 no. For um, for Honor, but Division uh, just shit itself. Like they didn't even try. They didn't even uh, fucking make the slightest attempt to try and recover Division because they'd already no, they made did. the money. That's what I'm they, saying. They, they did. They made it better. Yeah, it was too late. It was fucking way too late. That's and they did it with Siege, but Siege somehow has come back purely because of the esports community has brought siege back but there was a point where siege went like so far down that it was like almost bottom barrel and then they're like standard version fucking 12 dollars and then that's when i picked it up because well, that's I was like, when i picked it up yeah 12 dollars yeah. is like goddamn steal game's good but somebody worked out it's like 23 hours to earn enough money to buy a character without using premium currency so i mean that's a lot of time to play for like one character to like only 23 hours for him yeah 23 Holy. hours per character like or 23 or 22 it was but like edit like in 20 hours man that's so much gameplay like not for a loser like me that plays all day but i'll be right back i'm gonna take this call i mean yeah back to uh oh, man i can't remember what we were talking about i'm drunk and i got distracted <laughs> the point is dodro studios right who uh yeah exactly <laughs> <laughs> The, the guys that made Enter the Gungeon. Oh, okay. Um, is that a good make... game? Dude, yeah, is everybody it's amazing. amazing. It's oh, game. it's so good. And I played the it. thing, okay? No, zero microtransactions. No DLC. Well, it has it's just DLC, but they... It's like no. Free well, stuff. Okay, yeah. It's got content updates. Yeah. Which I guess technically you have to I mean, download. You on, I just so clicked on Enter the Gungeon and it says the most recent news from last year says Enter the Gungeon DLC canned so yeah. um but uh, i've just i've never liked it because it kind of looks like a meme to me like hotline miami stat like style really oh hotline miami one was so good god that was good. um i love that first game uh but the point is like they just put out again at dodge roll they just put out enter the gungeon and everything like that was in 2016 it's now 2019 and they've supported it up until now and that's been enough to keep the company going and now they're working on new projects i think that's the way you got to go though like you need to kind of make a get like if like because one quality game with constant updates and giving like making people pay for very minor shit to continue enjoying the game and putting out content i think that's like that's the way indies do it though because you don't feel fucked over because the base game is incredibly enjoyable but they're like couple of bucks here and there you're going to continue enjoying it it's going to give you a little bit more content and until we put something out and like for me i feel like that's an amazing bucks. idea it's it's not a couple of bucks there's no extra costs once you buy the game you have the game you have all updates oh it's all just free updating it's all free see that's the like and the, the only thing you can purchase is the soundtrack mm. oh, i'm okay with that yeah because you're a lover of collecting soundtracks as well that's like uh <clears throat> look it's not Fantastic. Is that <laughs> there go. Is that guy? Oh man. Bosh. Bosh, you got your first roast, bro. Oh my god. What? One year. Sorry I didn't bring you flowers, honey. It's okay, tiny viking. I don't know who Tourette's guy is. Oh, you don't you know, don't know guy who Tourette's guy is? Oh my god. Is? Thank you so much, tiny, for that tour. Wow. I can't even tell if you're memeing. Oh, uh, somebody, I... you have to send him Tourette's. Send him Tourette's guy. You're gonna fucking it's lose your shit. Meme. Dude, you, you look, actually, I didn't even notice. Oh my God, you do look a little bit like Tourette's is it, That is, that is, is actually it... really funny. I've never noticed that either. <laughs> <This guy. laughs> it's he specifically the... the blue shirt right now. This yeah, guy. he just wears the blue shirt. Yeah. <laughs> no, he has the mustache too. Yo, what up, Kanye? Oh, that is Yeah, that's funny as fuck. What? I have to finish it up. Dude, this is... I'm happy with this, man. We have to do this again. This is, uh, this is a lot okay. of fun. This is a fuckload of if fun. If I actually man. had Tourette's, I might be popular on Twitch. Oh, you're popular. <laughs> I like you. Are you oh, taking a shot at Sweden either right now? No. 
I'm not taking a shot. My queen. Your queen. My queen. My queen. My queen. Be my queen. How dare you? I will defend you till the end of time. My lady. <laughs> no, I like her. I'm just I will saying. defend your it's honor the, on the message boards. It's the flavor of the month right now. Blue shirt, glasses, mustache. Kanye's on the fucking ball. That is the best. Three roasts. You didn't make it to three roasts this time, Commissar. Sorry, bro. You only had two roasts tonight. You didn't... Oh, what was the second one? I don't remember. What was it? You uh, you had the same jawline as Lois Grif Griffin. Oh, yeah, yeah. I had the same facial, facial structure, structure as <laughs> yeah. Lois Griffin. <laughs> Such a... That's fucking great, dog. Oh, that is like... Like, that wasn't a burn. That was fucking lava, bro. That was just... you. That was so fucking good. A tactical oh. description, to be honest. With Turns you. out that's a person that knows Ryan. So now it's like a deep dive on who the fuck is coming in here to drop heavy memes. But I have to finish up. Thank you guys, everybody. Thank you to everybody. Please go follow Commissar. Uh, please follow Bosch. Please follow Tia Streams. Uh, they are all streamers, except for Tia. He's a pseudo streamer. He has all the aesthetic, but he just can't be fucked streaming. Pretty much. I do it like two or three times a week. <laughs> yeah all month he really just can't pick sometimes uh mm. this has been the super big boy show which